This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com. Parental discretion is advised. This show is brought to you by Slice on Broadway. Supporting Pittsburgh podcasting with the perfect pepperoni pizza. SliceOnBroadway.com. IndieWrestling.us. Check out IWC, RWA, and more. And listeners like you, support this show at Patreon.com slash Wrestling Just wait. Just wait. Just wait. Just wait. Just wait. Just wait. Hey guys, it is the Wrestling Mayhem Show, episode 707, and we are hunkered down in the Sorotron Media Bunker in Pittsburgh, PA, all alone in here, and uh, even we have curtains so the coronavirus can't see us, uh, but we are ready to talk professionalized wrestling, and kicking off tonight with Patreon in the bank, and we have basically everybody with us. I, I, If I do an intro, it's going to take 10 minutes. So I can tell you that Mad Mike is here as usual. I can tell you that Mainstream Matt is here to conduct the Patreon in the bank. And there you go. There's, there's, a, everybody's, got, everybody's got briefcakes tonight. We're for some reason. In. We got, we got Tina out there. We got Xander Gabriel out there because he was the announced guest before I knew this was Patreon in the bank. Uh, Marcus is out there filling in for somebody. Uh, did I say Tina yet? Um, uh, Peter Dinklage is out there. Bobby F J Town, Alex Cars, Bo Diggity. So many people. I think that's they. Ponders in here too, and everybody in the chat room uh, playing at home as well. It's the biggest night. We are starting with Mayhem Mania because we don't know how long the show is going to be, and <laughs> if we're rolling in, how many days it's going to be. So we're just getting into it. Please, get, let's get the business out of the way. Please check out everything at WrestlingMayhemShow.com. Please uh, uh, also drop us a line at that email address. Good times. Good time. Uh, really all of you in here only me and bobby they're all muted because they followed my directions <laughs> so it's okay it's probably better if we didn't all do that uh all right. good times at wrestling or 412 206 wms0 and please also subscribe to the show again wrestling subscribe to wrestling ma'am show on your favorite podcatcher or uh, you can ask your voicey device like the uh, google home or the Amazon Echo to play the Wrestling Mayhem Show podcast. I do sometimes just because it's kind of cool to be like, hey, lady, play the Wrestling Mayhem Show. Um, you can also join us here live every Tuesday because we got nowhere else to be uh, on the Wrestling Mayhem Show Facebook page at 9 p.m. Eastern Time, streaming a lot of other places, but the big conversation is happening right here on Facebook. Uh, so please join us here if you want to be a part of that. If you catch us later, please hit us up with the hashtag WMS707 to continue the conversation. And thank you to our Patreon supporters. I don't know if I should go down the list because most of you are here. Uh, give a little yell if you're hanging out in the, uh, in the. Uh, this is how we introduce you, uh, in the uh, Google Hangout here. <laughs> I love you in the chat room. Our Patreon.com <laughs> slash Wrestling Ma'am Show. Our friends at the fan of the show level. Bo Woo! 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 Thank you. Ed Burke, Bobby Thank F. J. Town Team Hammerfist, our friends at the Poppy Club, Bradley Brothers, Dave Podner, Kyle Turner, Daniel Towery, Tina Keys at the Pizza Club, Doc Remedy, the Wrestling and at the manager level, at various levels in the manager level, super and ultra managers, etc. cetera, uh, OccupyProWrestling.com, Mad Mike, and Farnsworth Investments all a part of this and this is the biggest night for the patreon supporters tonight with patreon in the bank and i will hand it over to mainstream matt to find out what in the world we are doing next do i need graphics do i need to pull up the graphics here is that what happens next it's early in the show i'm confused you know it couldn't hurt i mean you know the the lore is carefully and painstakingly preserved on the wrestling mayhem show Dom website for look back and see uh, just what a bunch of fools we are every year. So this is Mayhem Mania. It's kind of a competitive thought experiment. The goal is to create the best WrestleMania card possible, not necessarily to predict what WrestleMania would be. We're going to make it even better. Here's a little catch. Um, it's not really, you know, fantasy booking. It's kind of like reality booking uh, because... The instructions for all of our players is that everyone comes in their current physical, emotional, contractual, pharmacological, and state. Uh, so basically, 
You can't pull someone from another company to have your dream match. You've got to play by the same rules that Vince McMahon has to play by. You have to operate within the confines of our current reality. Try to think of it as uh, you're Vince McMahon with unlimited resources and zero self-control, and your company is not being consumed by you know a global panic. Uh, and try to so you're, pretend so that there's you're, actually so going to be just Vince McMahon. That's just how Basically, that works, right? You're just Vince McMahon. Vince McMahon, yeah. Vince McMahon two and very, a half weeks ago. Good, very good. <laughs> um, and, you know, try to imagine that we'll actually be fans here. You know, it's going to be an optimal uh, situation for the show itself. Um, we operate on a uh, kind of like a, a two-card um, system, all right? So we're trying to get eight matches into our super card. But every match that we create has to start on the undercard quote unquote so um you know players will come in every week and they'll create a match and uh when we bring in our players every, every week uh, have the option to make a change to one of the matches on our undercard and you know swap a guy for one for one take a match out entirely bring in an entirely new match with new people um swap out one guy bring one guy in add an extra person add an extra tag team to a match you know stuff like that if a match can survive for three weeks without being a in any way, it graduates to the super card. But as you'll see tonight, uh, we have streamlined the process because the final stop on the road to Mayhem got to get this eight match card done tonight. Um, so, like I said, we already have four uh, matches on the super card, and uh, I'm going to quickly run th through what we have here so far. Uh, Sorry, I'll see if you can keep up with us here. We're going to start with the undercard matches real quick, um, just to let everybody know what's going on there. Um, so are you ready or should I just, I'm just going to barrel ahead. Yes, okay. yes, go ahead. Don't mind if I do. Okay. Um, all right. And I, I apologize because I do not have jotted down exactly who created uh, these individual matches. So I'll help out. just bear with me. Uh, we've got Akira Tazawa and Kushida and Daniel Bryan versus Angel Garza and Andrade and Jorge Bali, the former King Cuerno for you guys who watched Lucha Underground. And that is created by Bobby FJ Town? That's me. Beautiful, Bobby. Uh, we have Walter, all caps, versus Keith Lee, versus Samoa Joe, and that is created by Rob Brown. We have Big E Langston versus Drew McIntyre, and that was created by Mad Mike. We've got AJ Styles versus Adam Cole versus Finn Balor. We have, who created that one? That would be Kyle uh, from Pit Fight. Kyle from Pit Fight. Yeah, he pulled a good move on that one. Uh, Shinsuke Nakamura versus Pete Dunn, created by... The Riz, Legero versus Sami Zayn, created by Alex Cars, and finally, <clears throat> Joaquin Wild versus Jordan Lynn versus Isaiah Swerve Scott versus John Morrison versus Ricochet, created by Billy Johnson. Good job, Billy. Um, now moving on to four matches we have on. The, oh, you will also note I've only gone through seven matches on the undercard. Ideally, there are eight. We'll get to that in just a second. Uh, on the super card, we have four matches that graduated so far. Uh, Mia Yim and Kaylee Ray and Tegan Knox versus Asuka and Kyrie Sane and Io Shirai. We have Bianca Belair versus Jazz. Uh, Tina created both of those matches, by the way. We have Edge versus Matt Riddle created by Chad the Shad. And finally, the latest match to graduate to the super card. <clears throat> and I love this one. Um, Reverend Vaughn and Deacon Batista versus Paul London and the Brian Kendrick. And that was created by the country hammer himself, Jamie Jameson. Now, typically what happens is when a match graduates, the person who creates the match gets to come back on the show and they get their rewards uh, for doing such a great job and creating such a great match. Unfortunately, uh, I don't know how socially distanced uh, the country hammer is right now, but we cannot locate him. Uh, he does know he graduated a match, so he does at least get the, the pride and the, the good feelings that come with knowing that you did a good thing. The rumor but, uh, is that yeah, the country we, hammer we is well. somewhere in the woods drinking some some Jameson, and and he is whether this is lifted or not, we won't see him for two months. That's a rumor. Well, you know what? It doesn't take away the fact that, that that is one hell of a match. The country hammer brought Reverend Devon and Deacon Batista back together again. I, he did. He did some real positive things. He did the so Lord's work. we thank him very much. He did the Lord's work. Um, and now, um, I mean, 
hate to see the wards go unused. So um, fortunately, we have, uh, Sork, we have a guest here with us tonight, Andrew Gabriel. And I figure, you know, what better way to kind of introduce some of the Mayhem Mania concepts and some of the stuff we'll be doing tonight than to run it straight through someone who has no idea what the hell we're talking about. Yes. And, perfect. you know, this will be great. Uh, so, Xander, how are you doing? Um, thanks for playing along. How are you doing? I already asked you that. Pretty good. Um, Pretty good. I'm glad good. to be here. Great. How are you? All right. I'm great. Um, so, I mean... So, so the gist of Mayhem Mania basically is, um, you know, you've got some room to operate in. So just try to, like, best you can here with this stuff. Um, first things first, as far as what we hand as far as rewards go. Uh, we've got a little contraption uh, as part of this game. Uh, not everyone that Mr. McMahon has access to is someone that you can bring um and use in Mayhem Mania because some uh, individuals have been stashed away in a thing that we lovingly refer to as space jail. Um, basically, they are uh, ineligible for used in Mayhem Mania. And one of the rewards that we give the players when they graduate a match, they get to send an individual to space jail. Uh, so Xander, I will at this moment offer you an opportunity to send an individual to space jail where there's no escape tonight. There is a no spin zone here tonight. No one's getting out of space jail. They go there, they stay there. Mm, unless we'll get to that in a second. Um, but Xander, first off, here's the six individuals who are in space jail right now. Um, they are Bailey, Sasha Banks, Randy Orton, Goldberg, Ronda Rousey. So those folks right now off limits. And so Xander, I just want you to deep, dip into the darkest recesses of your mind that the wrestler you like the least, the one you do not want to see in any match at all on this card, period. Uh, and let us know, and we will lock them up in Space Joe right now where they not harm anybody. And I can't pick someone that's already in a match, right? <clears throat> that's right, yes. And I think... Okay. So Although I have to... to know which person is in a match. I have to remember everybody that's in a match <laughs> first. Uh... You know, it's actually on the Wrestling Mayhem Instagram page, which I'm going to go to right now. Okay, so what the most recent okay. matches are, yes. Oh. Good plug, good plug. <laughs> Throw out some names. Throw out some names, and we'll, we, we can yeah, let we'll, you know. We'll tell you if they're in there or not. So, yes. somebody, so do they have to be a current wrestler, but just WWE? Really, I mean, just go for it. Red Hart. <laughs> You're not going to hurt anything. Red Hart? Okay. Oh, that is yes. a good pick. That's a good pick. That's an excellent All right. pick. All right. yeah. Excellent. So Ooh, we will get him Ooh, stashed Xander. away in the Ooh, space. Ooh, yeah. Xander. Don't be too hard on him here. Now he's doing the best he can. All right? Um, I thought it was Space Jam. That's why I picked it, but go on. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry about that. Could you imagine <laughs> Red Hart in <and> Space Jam? <laughs> <laughs> hey, these Wait, aliens are put... trying to take our ball. Did he put Bret Hart in Space Jail with Goldberg? Because that's not yes! that's not safe. That's not oh, safe. Oh, oh I hope they not. share a cell. I hope they share a fucking cell. <laughs> All right. All right. Hell in next, a cell. Um, All right. Next reward, Xander, that we were going to get to the uh, country hammer that now you have to mess with, is that uh, we um, kind of started this bit last year. Uh, something fun, um, kind of a uh, pre-show battle royal. We want to get more people onto the card. So uh, we call it the, the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Um, basically, it's a chance to kind of pull any name out of your head that you think you want to just see get into this mess. And uh, the nice thing about this, too, is that uh, you could double book people. So if they're already on the card, you don't have to worry about them being uh, stashed away. So far already in the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble, uh, the entrants are Shawn Michaels, Riddick Moss and Killer Cross. So, uh, is there anyone else you'd uh, offer us up who uh, you'd like to see in this big battle row for us? I'll just I'll just pick somebody safe. Big Show. That works. I'll take it. Star of the All Big right. Show show. Yes. <laughs> it's a great trailer. All right, Dander. Right. Now that you're warmed up. This is the part that probably is, this is the most challenging thing we're going to ask you to do. 
Um, we need eight matches on our undercard. Right now, we only have seven. I need you to create an entirely new match to fill this slot on the undercard that the rest of our players can come in behind you now and uh, start to play with. Or perhaps it will graduate and um, get the honor and distinction of you uh, to win a match in the Supercard Mayhem. Anyway, you make a match for us right now. So all I heard was I have to make a match for you right now. I didn't hear anything else. That's fine. That's the important That's part. That's really all you need to know. <laughs> so I choose the amount of people, the stipulation. No stipulations. We do that afterwards. Can't okay. wait to do a stipulation just yet. But uh, as far as people go, pick the people. Three-way, four-way, tag teams. Use your imagination. Whatever you okay. want. I'm a big fan of trios. So I'm going to do a three versus three. Do it. <laughs> now, can we use different incarnations of past wrestlers? Uh, have you noticed Deacon Batista on the list <laughs> and Reverend Devon? So on you one can't team, use Cowboy Bret Hart though, because you put him in space jail. On yes. one team, <laughs> I would like to have Dude Love, Mankind, and Cactus Jack. <laughs> okay, that might be a little tough. <laughs> we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. I'll fucking do this. We'll Wait, how do we handle... It's okay. It's all going to be pre-taped in the performance <laughs> area now, so it's fine. It's all good. Allowed? Good love. Mankind. <laughs> I, just have, I just have a thing in my head of just Vince yelling through some sort of headset, Damn it, Mac, change clothes! <laughs> you know what? This can, be more. this can be done. Go ahead. All right, Dana, who is he facing? Who, who, who are they are facing? My um, oh, bad. God, I really Gosh. hope you say Godfather Papa Shango and the Sultan. <laughs> hey, no hope, no hope for the studio no audience. Come on, stop. And they have to have been in WWE at some point. There's a flexibility here that I'm willing okay. to work with you on. Uh, gosh. Sir, tell you, you guys should give me a time limit. Otherwise, I'll be here for a while. Uh, that's all right. I brought a drink. I'm uh, good. Brother Bradley, Bradley's recommending three faces of Foley versus three faces of Danhausen. <laughs> I don't think Danhausen's ever been. In... Well, he was well, in, I mean, in, as long as was in a battle royal. He was in a battle royal. As, as, long, all three. as long as they're not signed to an ex- to another company exclusively, you can use them. Yeah, yeah, basically. And, and, so and, like, if they're signed to AEW or New Japan, they're off limits. But if they're in, if they're just in this way. and and they, and they just right, bring, right. bring people, this just, bring, just bring people in the loop. Danhausen did come out to a battle royal at Revenge as Danhausen, Pee Wee Hermhausen, Herham, Pee Wee Hausen, and uh, Stone Cold uh, Steve Hausen. Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay. Think, yeah. about this, think about this way, Xander. If Vince McMahon wanted badly enough to have freaking Danhausen in a match at WrestleMania, do you think he could make that happen? And if the answer is yes, then that's your answer. If anybody can have a blimp. <laughs> okay, I'm going to choose. <laughs> well, okay, it doesn't. Um, what's his name? Uh, who? What was Sammy Callahan's name in NXT? Oh, uh, Solomon, Solomon Crow. 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 Syndrome. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but isn't he signed to Impact? Yes, yeah, Sammy Callahan is by the impact. Nah, that's is that how is loose that are, we, are we using impact and signed? He has a three <laughs> three. He has a three picture deal with Pixar. I don't want. I don't want Sammy Callahan. I want his NXT persona, Solomon Crow. No, that's that right, I, can choose Solomon Crow. I don't think I could let that happen. Okay, I'm going to choose Michael Cole. <laughs> Uh, now we're getting somewhere. Michael Cole, baby. Michael uh, Cole. Let's do Byron Saxton. Yes. <laughs> Who can go, by the right. way? Michael Cole, oh. Byron Saxton. JBL. Okay. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, so oh, oh that was a good team. That was a good team. So mm-hmm. where he was going to say. Right there for everything was. 
Beautiful. All right. I should Peter, down. Thank you very much. You've done us a great service. There you go. Updated on the big board. Yep, it is updated on the big board. Mm -hmm. All right. One more note about Space Joe before we get into the cast of characters that we have lined up here, Storgy. Uh, the order of play. I'm going to let it lay out the order of play real, right now real quick as we get into Patreon the bank. Uh, leading off will be your friend and mine, Bo Diggity. Batting second, Bobby F. J. Town. Hill Bradley coming in third. Dave Podner, then Tina, Kyle Turner, then Doc Remedy, represented by his proxy. Then Farsworth, represented by his proxy, and Alex Cars. And batting not I mean, it doesn't matter. Finally, bring it up the rear. Mad Mike. Now. Note, note about space jail because <laughs> we don't want to make this too complicated some of you depending on your tier as a patreon supporter have been granted the ability to send an individual to space jail at any time you choose during this round you don't have to do it right now you can wait until perhaps someone who's on the card slips off the card, something like that um so five people could have a ticket to send someone to space jail they can use any time during this round. Um, Doc Remedy's proxy, who is Sorg, Cal Turner, Marcus, who's representing Farnsworth, Alex Cars, and Mad Mike. You five have one shot, one ticket to send someone to space jail. Anytime you choose, just butt in, let us know. Pat? Also, Pat? a few of you, yeah. Yes. I'd like, I'd, I'd like to cash in my Patreon in the bank. With the space jail move. Okay. Send it. Charlotte Flair. <laughs> the sip. Hasn't, hasn't Charlotte already been in space jail? Oh, no, she hasn't. Okay. Not this year. A good reminder that we need to make sure now. That don't send it. She money. has been in there the is past. No, Alex. There is no space jail double jeopardy. Thank okay. you. Okay. So okay. we can't. Um, yeah, there. That, that's fair to clarify. That. Already been there. Matt, Matt I, I'd yeah. also like to cast my vote for space jail. Okay. Um, Hornswoggle. Damn it. Ha ha! Yes! I'm just yes. kidding. I didn't have him in mind. <laughs> that's a lie. That's a lie. Wait. You don't want to send Hornswoggle? No, no, I want to send Hornswoggle to Space Jail. Fuck him. Okay. Yeah. I don't know if it's going to fit on here. All right, we're going to... Uh, oh, he'll fit. Or... He's very tiny. Matt? Matt? Yes, sir. I am a proxy for for one, but I am also a proxy for another who does not have a Space Jail move. But uh, for him, I'm going to use that Space Jail move I have for Mr. Remedy. And send Chris LaRusso to Space Jail. <laughs> now we're talking. All right. Bill Bradley will be we have, um... can, we, can we also put uh, Chris in Space Jam? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, while we're at it. All right. I, I didn't feel the, um, the, the towering uh, shadow of Chris LaRusso hanging over this. Uh, this night, but uh, you know, no, it was you know, it's uh, safe. Better to be safe than sorry, you know. I always say. There you go. Um, yes. And anyway, as someone, as someone pointed out, you cannot send someone back to space jail who's always already been in space jail. There's no space jail double jeopardy. So to let you guys know who's already escaped from space jail this year, uh, The Undertaker, Lacey Evans, Enzo Amore, John Cena, Bobby Goddamn Fish, and uh, finally the WLC stipulation. Those have already been in space jail. Space jail. Don't ask how it happened. It just happened. All right. Um, can we put things back in this? Wait, so, so we can't put things back into space jail? Yes, you can. And not. Okay, good. That's something a, that'd be a really terrible space, space jail. That's already. A, I mean, wait, it's, it's a, a terrible space jail. It's already a really low, low security space jail by the sounds it's of minimum it. Minimum so. security facilities. Yes, yeah, definitely. So um, how do I buy up to put something back into space jail? Because I would like to do that. How do I do that? Uh, you can't put something. Back in space, broken out of space, Joe. You just if you want to send somebody to No, no, I didn't say that. You misheard me. <laughs> the rules are very clear Follow the on lore, this. guys. Yeah, follow the lore. Seriously. Uh, AJ, right, just out of curiosity, what, 
What did you want to send back into space jail? Who do the you Undertaker. think I want to send back into space jail? Fuck the Undertaker. <laughs> <laughs> you, need your, you need we your poop break. break. You got it. I knew exactly who he was talking about. <laughs> I know. I just want to hear him say it. <laughs> the man that's behind you. you. <laughs> Look out. He's right behind <laughs> you, Mike. You have 40 minutes to get away. <laughs> 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 but he but he has tigers now so 30 minutes oh i really hope his entrance his, his entrance better include tigers now yeah oh, man that'd be awesome um Anyways. all right in addition to um all of you who got the right to send someone to space jail and uh and kyle used to this, uh there's also a tier our manager level guys uh, I've granted them uh, basically the right to get a court order to get someone out of space jail since we're not spinning the wheel tonight. Uh, so Marcus, Alex, and Mad Mike, you could free someone from space jail anytime you choose. Matt, again, Matt, you don't have to use it right now. I'm uh, sorry. But if you choose what? The, yes, hello? Who is in space jail again? I'm sorry. The, uh, it's, yes. not, it's, not, it's not on no, the okay, site. Okay. But, uh, okay, that's okay. Um, Bailey, Sasha Banks, Randy Orton, Goldberg, Triple H, Ronda Rousey, Bret Hart, Charlotte Flair, Horn Swoggle, Chris LaRusso. Okay, uh, let's 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 free Bailey. Let's free Bailey. Yeah, she served her time. She, she's the SmackDown Women's Champion. She should she deserves some damn respect. Okay, yeah, she's. I'm not gonna been, lie. I was she's actually been in there. Do that. Uh, been in there for a while. It's been, she a, been a pretty respect. long time. Okay. All right. Now it's time to get down to business. Uh, I think I've covered it. Sorry. Yeah, have I forgotten anything here? I, no, don't, I don't know what you would have really forgotten at this setup. point. You, you just, okay, just okay, good deal. Roll ahead. Let's get cracking. Oh, diggity. Yes, sir. Let's get down. Let's get to work. Um, okay. Do I, I get got all of the things? I got all of the things to do? I will tell you um, what you have here to do. Um, first of all, this is something fresh. Um, I need you to nominate someone to be the host of this year's Mayhem Mania. Mm-hmm. I love this. Um, I'm going to go with a uh, uh, Pittsburgh legend floating dumpster on 51. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. All right. All right. Seemed. Wow. Wow. We're, we're starting off hot. I love this. I mean, God bless the internet. Oh, I'm sorry. Listen, guys. if under if under if Undertaker's going to be out of space jail, floating dumpster needs to be the host. Okay. That dumpster was on I fire mean, too. Everyone. <laughs> oh. What the? Hell? Yeah. Okay. Great. Okay. Um. Oh, diggity, um, please uh, name us a, uh, an entrant for the uh, Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Uh, he's uh, number number one in your program, number one in your heart, uh, Juventud Guerrero. Okay. Yes, the juice is loose. <laughs> All right. Uh... All right, Bob Diggity. Now yeah, you uh, you have a chance now to make a uh, I guess what you would call a uh, standard move to the undercard. Uh, so there's eight on the left of your screen if it's up there right now. Yeah. And it is. Um, all right. right. So I, I see a lot of matches here. You guys have done great work. Sometimes you guys have put together some some just truly poop matches in the past. This year, not the case. I mean, there's no there's no reason to lie. I mean, you don't have to like prop anybody up here i mean we all understand that yeah it's I'm, a process yeah i'm going to promote can i promote to the super card can i do that i can't let you do that but i can let you make a change to one of those card matches on the undercard and then you will have an opportunity to add a stipulation to uh, one of those undercard matches mm, i am going to add i'm going to add a person to a match because i know i can okay. do that and I'm going mm-hmm. to add uh, Buddy Murphy to the Walking Wild, Jordan Devlin, Isaiah Scott, John Morrison, Ricochet match. Okay. That's I want good. A big strong. I want a strong good. I know, uh, in that match. 
um, I, I know, I definitely know that Marcus Mann think that's a great idea. Um, because it's so, about to get yeah. it's about to get yeah. cooler. So let's, let's uh, there's plans, chess moves here, man. Yeah, yeah, we got it, we got it. Um, all right, we are now going to uh, uh add a uh a stipulation, a uh special referee. Uh, you know how this works: a special referee, a stipulation, a championship. Uh, mm-hmm. to one of these undercard matches. Uh, oh, Diggity, you got something in mind? Maybe. I very much do because that that Morrison Devlin Wild Swerve Ricochet and now Buddy Murphy match just became a Money in the Bank match. Okay. And I want to watch people fly off ladders. Is really what it is here. Excellent, excellent. Okay. All right, Bo. So, I thank you for your service. <laughs> yes, is is one of the is the literal original Patreon. Uh, I, I'm I'm proud to to serve as uh, in my role as a Patreon, as I do every single year, uh, even though this is this is the one time that anybody from the show contacts me. So you're you're <laughs> I'm kidding. Is there any? Uh, I'm kidding. <laughs> I do have an open invite. Is there a, I, a, me, in. I would run into I would run into Sorg Studio, which I still have not been to, if it weren't for this stupid virus. So here we are. Just gonna cash it in. Oh, show oh, up. Thank you. Open open invite when the when this clears up. Yeah, when it when it clears up, which will be sometime in the year twenty twenty two. It's fine. <laughs> Social distance. So far away from. They're th- they're still doing all the pirate. They're still doing all the stupid pirate stuff inside the performance center, right? I oh god, maybe. Oh, please, I think I heard. Please listen. I wanted. I just wanted to happen, just so it's like, oh hey, we bought all this shit at Party City and we can't take it back because well, the, the stores that there are closed. Are so we gotta... they borrowed it from Adam Rose's. Uh... <laughs> they, <laughs> they no Paul butts. Burchill. They got Paul Burchill shit or out of the Paul Burchill, yeah. Brought it all down. <laughs> You actually have to swing into the ring via a rope. Damn it! Now I want to book Katie Lee Virtual in the match. Well, <laughs> sorry, Mitch Pants. Yeah, a of crocodile for them to swing over. Okay. All right. All right, Bo Digging. We must move along. Thank you very much. You set the bar. Thank you very much. Uh, let's Bobby F J Town in here, and let's uh, get down to business on this one. Bobby, I gotta fi- follow the dumpster. <laughs> yeah. Um, Nominate. A- Post Mayhem Mania, and apparently it does not have to be human. So, uh... <laughs> Alright then, um... <laughs> How about Mr. Peanut? <laughs> I, thought, okay. I thought you were going to say Gritty. I'm Mr. Sorry, Peanut I'm is dead, no, but I will gritty. Uh, I'll let you have one. Baby Peanut. <laughs> Baby Peanut. I don't know. I, I just popped peanut. into my head. Baby Peanut it is. All right. Um, hey, is this is this show even Bobby. live on Facebook anymore? I oh, lost we're working on. We're still live on Twitter. <laughs> was okay, that that bad? Sure. Yeah, yeah. Was, that, <laughs> was it that bad of? Yeah, Facebook. No, no, no. Facebook dumped us, but no, no, no. Uh, but everybody's been having trouble lately. So. Facebook yeah, said, don't Bobby, worry. Up, no, no, no. actually knocked out the feed. That's what happened there. So, Mr. Um, Bobby, a name, bad choice. Bobby, name an entrant for the Mayhem Buster Battle Rumble. You know who this is going to be. It's been my pick every year for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Royal. Um, she's already in a match for Mayhem Mania, but she has to be in the Battle Royal. Asuka. That's my girl. Okay. Your girl. That's my girl. We're going to see if we can get you to like accompany her to the ring for that one. Okay. Uh, Bobby. <laughs> Mr. Peanut accompanies to the ring. Led to the Mr. ring by Peanut Mr. Peanut. Peanut. <laughs> Oh, let's go. Bobby, <laughs> Bobby um, a, uh, make a move to this. Uh, make a chance. Make an upgrade to this. Uh, one of these uh, undercard matches. All right. All right. Um, Riz is going to be mad at me. Uh, but this is what I wanted Certainly to do last mad. week. I'm going <laughs> to I'm gonna make a swap. Okay. I'm going to switch. Okay. Shinsuke Nakamura into my match. <laughs> And I'm going to okay. shift Tazawa over against Pete Dunne. Because that's what I wanted to do all <laughs> along. You know what? I like it. I like it. I, okay. I like it. Who doesn't want to see uh, T- Tazawa versus Pete Dunne? <laughs> oh, I can think of a bunch of people I probably don't want to. That'd be a good match. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. 
Okay. On this episode of 205 Live. <laughs> and then, with my stipulation, I'm going to make that a boneyard match, whatever the hell that is. <laughs> All right. Boneyard so is ready. Actually, no, make it, make it what it should be, an elephant graveyard match <laughs> from the Lion King. Because <laughs> I don't know what a boneyard need, match is. What, which match is this? I need, I need your final answer, Bobby. Is it a boneyard match or an elephant it's Our it's an match. elephant graveyard match. Elephant graveyard. Okay, very good. Uh, I'm done. Okay. Okay. I didn't even use my puppets. I, I realized I haven't made any uh, space shell moves. I want to make a space shell move. All right, Marcus. What do you got? Uh, I guess because I forgot about how much I hate him and how I don't want him to be Please on the Please don't send like Mr. Peanut. CM Punk in the, in the space jail. Aww. CM Punk. You want to say, oh, CM Punk. Oh, that's right. You've been... Wow, I've been lying and wait, waiting for that one. Yeah, at least we'll see a okay. punk on the show. At least it wasn't Mr. Peanut. I mean, isn't it though? Thankfully, we got him. He he was too happy that the oh. Cubs beat the Pirates that year in the wild card, and I am done with CM Punk. See, this has nothing to do with his uh, wrestling or history. This is literally like non wrestling fan sports ball spite directed at him. Yeah, he's a, he's a jerk. Okay. Sure. Hey, Matt. No, I mean he says so right on his uh. Tw- yes. Sorry, sorry to interrupt. I have I have two questions. Well, a question and, and something else. Uh, question. Cool. Just for yeah. clarification, what match got added? What match has the stipulation of, of elephant graveyard match? Uh, be uh the Nakamura and Kushida and Daniel Bryan versus. No, 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 Hazal versus Pete Dunn has the uh, elephant graveyard stick. <laughs> oh, oh, Thank you, Bobby. Actually, you know what? It was a mistake. I, I um, I mean that's obvious. I mean I don't know what other kind of stipulation would on Hazal versus Pete Dunn. Anyway, the, the reason I, I, I had the idea. That's. I just wanted to know because I'm actually taking notes on this as we go. I'm I'm being smart <laughs> this year. Uh, the the boneyard match apparently they still don't have official stipulations for that. They haven't even figured. And they probably out. won't. It's, it appears don't play to be a it right very here. live match. I don't know where you're going to put that much dirt inside a <laughs> performance center. No, I have to, you oh, have, I mean, yeah. you have to I've eat. Heard that, I've heard they may actually be filming it on location. You have to I mean, eat that, chicken wings like, and then throw the bones on the ground and wrestle on top of the bones. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a way eating contest. It's a smoky bones. <laughs> you have mm-hmm. to go to a rib shack. <laughs> you have to beat each other to death with a full rack of ribs. <laughs> Okay. Oh, okay. Um, all right. Um, all right, Matt. Matt, the other thing I, I wanted to do is I actually would like to make my other space jail move. I'd like to free okay. someone from space jail. And who's that going to be? I would like to free CM Punk from space jail. Wow. Oh, wow. He doesn't Sorry, care Marcus. about you. He doesn't care about you. Wait, my voice is a voiceless. All right. Well, oh boy. Oh, okay. Well, we'll, 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 we'll let you guys kind of stare at each other through the live stream for a little bit now. Um, we're this is supposed to be Heal Bradley right here, Sorg. Okay. Uh, but apparently we're having trouble locating him. Well, he he, he well, he's he's out there in the chat room, which we the Facebook has taken us down. Apparently, we are too extreme for Facebook right now. Uh, so we're but we're still live on Twitter and Twitch, and I believe maybe the YouTube as well. Stream. Yes. Yeah, so uh, we're out the there. X. So I hope you guys yeah. are. <laughs> so I I don't know what's going on, we... but everybody's having problems. So I'm not surprised by any of this. Um, but he has. Put me as a proxy, and I I made I made the one thing. Yeah, he says I give it. He says I gave you the Patreon move because he deleted my match uh, previously. So um, mm-hmm. let me. So what I can make? Uh, just is this a, just a general move, or what do I? What's going on? Great. All right, this is good. This is good, Sorg. All right, because um, Hill Bradley. Now we're moving up into tier two of the Patreons. All right, so it's gonna get hot. All right. So, um, first of all, Hill Bradley has to nominate a host for Mania. Wait, another host to go along with Dumpster Fire? Yeah, we have we're, we're nominating, Sorg. Oh, think nominating. We we're, we're nominating. There's going to be a vote. And I know that, you know, it's a foregone conclusion that the floating dumpster on Route 51 is going to win. Yeah. But we do this process. Yeah. The process. Okay. Well, this is easy. 
This yeah. is easy. Oh, man, I can only pick one? Mm. Mm. Uh, I'm flexible. Oh, uh, you know what? Screw it. War horse. <laughs> War horse. Okay. War horse. I'm ready. Excellent. I'm ready for WrestleMania to rule ass. Yeah. Yeah. Me yes. too. Yes. Me too. Warhorse, right, if now, you guys are um, not familiar, indie wrestler. I believe he is currently the IWTV independent wrestling champion or wrestling independent TV champion, something like that, internet champion. Uh, that, and no, that's he, right. Independent champion. That seems right. Okay. And uh, yeah. he has the best Twitter account ever. A lot of good videos. Yes. Go look at him. All right. Now we are. We- now that we're up to we're up to tier two, we we are going to expand that a little bit. I need you to nominate, uh, and this this is specifically done because of bad mic from last year. I need you to nominate a musical guest. Musical guest. Well, Limp Biscuit for Mayhem Mania. Limp Biscuit. <laughs> Limp Biscuit. Okay. I mean Limp Biscuit. The the I mean it's it's the WWE and Wrestling Mayhem show's favorite band. Red light, the green light. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Quick uh, side uh, note: Limp Bizkit should be in the WWE Hall of Fame. Absolutely. Let's let's, let's keep that especially conversation going. In, especially I don't, in I don't the age like of Limp social Bizkit, distancing. Put him in the Hall of Fame. Yeah, yeah. I mean, when like, is, uh, now that the British Bulldog is in, we need a new champion, a, a new cause to champion. So I, I think that's the one we should. Absolutely. Be Sorg did it all for the nookie. Did you guys, um, did you guys know that Limp Bizkit has tour dates currently? Today I learned. Yeah, they well, played that, in a sheet. No, that's, yeah. that's because they. That's because they have a whole song about social distancing. Mm-hmm. Where the fuck wow. you at, punk? Shut the fuck up and back the fuck up while we fuck mm. this track up. Come on, it's yeah. right there. Wanna, it's just one of those days. All right, exactly. Solidifying <laughs> that explicit. They will be at the Central Florida Fair in Orlando, Florida, what? Thursday, September seventeenth, Friday, September eighteenth. Yeah. At Rebel Rock Fest. Hey, to be Get fair, Florida allows gatherings. Florida allows gatherings of under ten people. That's about a Limp Biscuit concert. Oh, oh, oh no. uh, also, <laughs> also at that, um, also at that show, uh, Pittsburgh band Anti Flag. Congratulations, Anti-flag. everybody! We did it. Yes. <laughs> Looks we like they it. made it. Sorgan, we need uh, Keel Bradley to give us an entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Royal. Uh, Cluster Battle Royal. Let's go with uh, do 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 do. Which one's the one that's still moving? Bushwhacker, Luke. Wow. Wow. Which one's the one? Is that the one who's still moving? moving? Okay, I believe so. I believe so. If I'm wrong, the other one. But I believe I'm pretty sure. Mobile, mobile Bushwhacker. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just put in parentheses the mobile one. And by the, and by the way, Brad, you have to own these moves. I'm putting your right, right name right next to them, so everyone knows that this knew, is your idea. Hey, he knew what he was getting into when he nominated me. Sword. Yeah, he knew who he was getting. Yeah. yeah. Um, all right, Sorg. Now you have a chance to make um make a move um to one of these under matches. Uh, because you are tier two, and it's just all the standard you know moves that we normally have. The subtraction is also on the table for you. Uh, for one of these undercard matches. So uh-huh. do your worst. Uh-huh. Okay. All right. I'm looking uh-huh. at this. I'm looking at this. I'm looking at this. And I'm looking at... I have a weird one. Wait. You know who's not here? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Because you know what? He gave me this because he deleted my move. And I need to make something right. Okay. And I don't know where I'm going to make that right. I think I'm going to make it. After let's all. let's Sorry. add to Big E versus Ma- Drew McIntyre. You know, Sorg. Elias. Sorg. Hmm. God damn it. Yes. I like it. I hate I hate throwing another three way in there, but I gotta get Elias in, and I I can't decide who to get rid of there because I feel like if I got rid of either one of them, it would just be a typical SmackDown match. It it's still a typical. Gotta match. make it special. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean, we can make yeah. it special later, I guess. But you know, you should have put Elias in the Elijah graveyard match, Sorg. Mm. All right. But, well, let's okay. Um, Sorg, you can uh, add a stipulation uh, to any match. Undercard or supercard. Hmm. So okay, okay. I'm looking at 
that match I just made, and it does need something special. So uh, we all see. Wow. Alrighty. All right. Wait, 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 wait. Can I resend that? Can I resend that? Can I resend that? I got a better idea. Sure. I got a better idea. Yes. Uh, we do it. We Symphony of Destruction match. <laughs> tiny <laughs> guitars. Tiny <laughs> guitars. <laughs> tiny pianos. The world's smallest bassoons, violin. The world's smallest violin. We. God damn it! Y'all are wild. Oh, uh, there's gonna be a lot of baby grand spots in that match. That's right, baby Somebody grand spots all over the place. There it is. There it is. I love it. Wow. I love it. All right, fantastic. Uh, Bradley, inhabiting the body of Sorg, I thank you very much. Yes. Uh, let's get Dave Podner on the line here. All right, I Podner. am here. Dave. Yes. Nominate a host for Mayhem Mania. Okay. Now, this is something, this is a move I think will make not only me happy, but both our wives happy, Matt. <laughs> the wife play. Wow. I am nominating Twin Magic. Oh my god. Oh no. Wait a minute, wait a minute, oh wait no. a minute. Oh no. Not not wait, wait. Wait, wait. I'm not talking that twin magic. I'm talking the tits and lips twin magic what? of Darcy and Stacy from 90 Day Fiance. <laughs> what the hell? He I am just, no, he made very, the, he made the Crisley knows best pull that I respected <laughs> so much. Go ahead. <laughs> Wow. wow. Good. Okay. Uh, you know what? Shit. <laughs> Darcy and Stacy. Start if there's two uh, people who should be about. in WWE, it's those two. Man, now I'm, yeah. I, 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 I mean, feel like I, I no should someone from Temptation Island. <laughs> uh, Potter, nominate a musical, musical guest. <laughs> Musical guest. Now, this is a musical guest who just recently came on the stage. Someone who has exploded. Uh, it just exploded on Twitter. Mm -hmm. The the dulcet musical tones of Nikki Cross. Mm. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> I love you, Nikki. And if it's quite all right, I need oh, you, man. Nikki. Oh, the sinful Scottish sex pop herself, Nikki Cross. Oh yes, yes, <laughs> yes. Her, 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 just um, uh, serenading Killian yeah, as they're working I, out at their own gym. She can Twitter. sing Alexa to the ring. <laughs> oh yeah. All right, Podner. Yep. Give me an entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. I am going to add Sami Zayn to that. Great liberator. All right. All right. Now and, you have a chance to make a move to one of the matches on the undercard. And just as it was before you, a subtract option is on the table for you. And I will point out to you that there are many, many wooden multi man matches on this undercard right now. Well, I'm I, the reason I added Sammy is I'm going to delete the match he's in completely. <laughs> so at least I wanted him on the show. Wow. Because one thing I noticed, this is one thing that for another organization I've been complaining about for, what, like eight months now, there's not enough women on the show. Amen. So hey, I'm, adding, All right, what do you got? I, I'm adding a tag match. I'm adding the tag team of Piper Niven and Tony Storm to face the greatest women's tag team in WWE history, Mayhem Mania needs to be iconic. Yes, Dave uh, Podner. Ah, oh, you, you glorious son of a bitch. <laughs> I'm cool with this. I can, I, I can. Definitely I can the greatest that. tag team in the history of Mayhem Mania. Nothing beats the the clamoring for the iconics. Dave, if you didn't add him, I was just going to put him in somewhere. I know there are no fucking I miss him very much. Hey, Kyla! <laughs> she goes, you gotta be joking that. me. Uh, Dave, now, for my stip stipulation, for my stipulation, any up, as you see right now, even though it's on the Super Bowl. Yeah. Now, 
I am waiting for the groan from Mad Mike. Oh, no. Because I'm going to touch the Walter, Keith Lee, and Samoa Joe match. Because that needs to be vicious. So I'm making that a last man standing match. Wait. In a three-way? In a three-way. I'm confused on a three-way last man standing match. Let them figure it out. They'll figure it out. Figure it out. It be an elimination? It's truly, it is truly last wouldn't man standing. So would there be elimination? Like... Yeah, I think. Hold on, hold on, hold on, Marcus. Yeah, Marcus is the only Booker here, I believe. Yeah. If you, uh... if you, some, how would you, how would you do a a three way last man standing match? You know, I think at one point I did watch a tag team last man standing match. Yes. Which is the dumbest thing I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> uh, wait, wait, like, wait, wait. Have you also seen, have you also seen the three way casket match? No, I have not. I have oh, seen that. that. I have there seen that. There was one of those on Lucha. There was one of those on Lucha. There was one on Lucha. And, yeah. and uh, uh, one Elias was in one here in the Pittsburgh area. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, so a three way last stand Last man standing match, uh, logistically would probably have to be an elimination where if you didn't reach a ten count, you would have to head to the back. You'd have uh, to otherwise, have that match would technically take forever. You'd have to have two referees, probably. Yeah, maybe. You, you you get somebody like knocked out or taken out of the match somehow. You have them removed from the match. Well, we could also well, let me have ask you something. Has Joe has Joe officially been cleared? That's an excellent question. Because I don't uh, know yeah, if he's officially I, 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 cleared or not. Yeah, I don't know either. But you know what? It's not my mess to clean up anymore. It's your guys' mess. So, uh, <laughs> rolling here. All right. Um, what else do we got? Podner, we still. Oh, you're done, Podner. Yeah, that is everything Podner. for me. Thanks for uh, thanks for all your hard work. Thanks for giving Sorg all that cheddar. So uh, <laughs> be on your way. Let's get Tina. I am on my way. <laughs> Tina. Hello, hello. Ah, oh, so happy to see you. Uh, <laughs> would you please uh, nominate nominate a host for Mayhem Mania? Mm, let's see. Um, he doesn't have anything to do. For a while because sports ball is suspended for right now so this is kind of like blitz seattle seattle seahawks mascot <laughs> <laughs> yes. okay Seahawks. okay if we're ranking if we're throwing other mascots out there the, the mascot for the grizzlies has gone through multiple tables so <laughs> Mm-hmm. I'm just saying the Grizzlies mascot would be pretty dope. They're not doing anything right now. Hey, AJ, uh, just a heads up. You're a little lower than you were earlier in the show, so I don't know if there's been a change on your end. Uh, it helps well, also my microphone is not hey, Yeah, his microphone's up in the top yeah, there. There it is. Temp microphone down here. Yeah, Memphis Grizzlies mascot goes through tables. Put him in there. Uh, yeah, I should also shout out right now that Cal Turner's on deck, so he's out there somewhere. I know he's monitoring this. Uh, yeah. Uh, Tina, now I'm going to think Musical guest, Mayhem Mania. Musical guest. Musical guest. Well, I would rather have Mad Mike introduce it. He knows who the musical guest is going to be. Go ahead, Mike. Poppy. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Tina. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. I, I love this. All right. I'm doing my work for me, so I get to really go nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Ponder put the iconics on the card. Right, the nominated Poppy. <laughs> All right, Tina, give us an entrant, uh, another entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Um, Walter. Oh shit, Walter. Okay. Oh Long man, Walter, Walter versus Oscar. Oh yeah, you got that showdown. That'll almost be as intense as the. Uh, Johnny St. Hulk Hogan uh, face-to-face that was going to come up during last year's AM Cluster Battle Rumble. All right, um, Tino, now it is time to make a move, um, a change to uh, one of the matches on the undercard. And again, for you, subtract option is on the table. Well, I'm just going to make a new match entirely. 
Um, yeah, let's do that. Which one are we gonna get rid of? That clusterfuck of a six way. <laughs> um, All right. Oh no. Oh man. Now I. Now, now, now I will remind you. You must tread carefully now because the stipulation is still going to be there. It's a money in the bank match. Now, don't <laughs> let that stop you. Because we've got a last man standing match in a three way. Just letting you know. Going. Okay. In, that that's a thing. All right. So what you got? Well, okay. So since it's a money in the bank stipulation match, I'm going to go ahead and make it. A, I was going to make it a tag team match, but I'm going to go ahead and make it a four way. Mm. All right. Uh, Tyler Bate, Trent Seven. Uh, As um, let's see, Drew Gulak. Yes. Yeah. And yes. Timothy and Timothy Thatcher. Did you get all four? Timothy. Yep, I got him. Okay. Listen, if if someone was going to go ahead and ruin a flippy dude match, I you did. made it a grapplers match, and I'm here for it. So, <laughs> I okay, it. carry on. There's the money in the bank grapplers match enough. too. Somebody's getting the... somebody's getting choked out on top of a ladder. Drew Gulak is going to make that ladder tap out. It's going to be great. <laughs> it was what happens from the when Thatcher has to climb the ladder? That's what I want to know. <laughs> All right. Tina, you can add a stipulation to any match you see, undercard or supercard. Um, and don't let existing stipulations distract you, uh, discourage you either. You could just pile them all onto one match if you want to. I really don't. Special referees, special ring announcers, Al Roker hanging from a shark cage, you know, something like uh, you know, just <laughs> get the imagination um, flowing. Right. Can I change my host to Al Roker hanging from a shark cage? <laughs> Bobby, too late. Maybe someone else will help you out. <laughs> no, it's okay. Oh, let me see. That tri that trio's let's see, that trio's match that Bobby had created. Um let's go ahead and make that a uh win by knockout or submission. Okay. Or submission only. I like it. Wait, which map is that? Uh, um, oh gosh, what was it? Um, Daniel Bryan, Kushida. Oh gosh, Nakamura. Uh, oh, Nakamura. Okay. Nakamura, Kushida, Bryan versus Garza. So you're putting Daniel Bryan in the uh, match with the largest potential for head injury, right? <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. He doesn't need to take the it's finish. That could happen. Yeah, he's fine. Yeah. He's fine. He's an adult. But he's an adult. He's Daniel okay. Bryan, and he's gonna be like, "Ooh, do me, do me." All right. Uh, did Did you watch that match with Gulak? <laughs> yep. Several. Yeah. 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 He'd rather know you than throw you. Great. All right, Tina, thanks a lot. Looks great. Uh, let's see if we can track down Kyle Turner. All right, Kyle so, Turner is with us. On, uh, so Facebook Facebook is that. I can't even do like a phone Facebook Live at this point. So like they're down. Great. But we are still streaming on the Periscope as well as the Twitch, and I believe the YouTube as well. I haven't verified that, but everybody appears to be in the Twitch. I'm sorry, the Periscope, including Kyle. And Matt, we've had a last-minute update that Kyle is actually now in the Pizza Club. Whoa. Yes, that's right. He is tier three now. Yes, so yes. he's going to, this is going to be the, our first introduction to what happens now in tier three. So I'm just going to start laying stuff out here for him. We're going to look for his answers. And yes. as he's going through, uh, if there's a lag, I'll, I'll try to do yeah. some recapping so, so, here yeah, so, so, as we go through it. So, first, so, so, so Kyle, feel free to, to drop your moves as he's kind of going through your options, I guess, if you could. Yeah. So first thing, Kyle, I need you to do is to nominate a host for Mayhem Mania. A host and I will let you Mania. know that so far, so far the nominees are the floating dumpster on Route 51, <laughs> such a baby Mr. Wonder. Peanut, <laughs> baby Mr. Peanut, War Horse, Darcy and Stacy from 90 Day Fiance, <laughs> and Blitz the Seattle. Jeez. Jeez. And then what else does he get? While we're waiting, uh, he is also going to uh, nominate a musical guest. Musical guest for uh, Mayhem 
Mania. So far, we've got nominated uh, Limp Biscuit, Nikki Cross, and Puppy. And because we're now into Tier 3, uh, Kyle is going to get to be the first person uh, tonight to nominate a member of the Mayhem Mania announced team. Ooh, so we're going to find out uh, who we're going nice. to put behind the table uh, for this thing. Now, we need some power. I will also remind Kyle that he still has a ticket to Space Jail. He can uh, deploy at any time to send someone into Space Jail. Uh, and I also let the uh, find market uh, release someone from Space Jail still if he chooses to. He can release one person from Space Jail tonight if he wants. So let's see if Kyle is going to come through here for us. Not seeing anything just yet. No, uh, let's uh, recap uh, kind of where we stand right now. Right, oh, for me... the host, he's going to go with Dario Cueto. Oh. Everybody's doing my moves for me. <laughs> El Jefe himself. Very good, Kyle. Um, while you uh, put the uh, musical guests, let's go through uh, the undercard matches real quick here. First off, uh, we now have Nakamura and Kushida and Daniel Bryan. This is uh, Angel Garza, Andrade, and Jorge Bali in a knockout or submission only match. And, uh, oh, this just in. Um, Kyle is sending Seth Rollins to Space Jail. Wow. Wow. All right. All right. All right. All right, all right, all right. I'm careful for you right now. Um, right. As we still await his uh, nominee for musical guest. <laughs> Try to get this in here quickly. Yeah, you know, I mean th this uh this um digital big board is uh it's nice, uh but you know there's nothing like the old uh you know the 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 darkly forged uh yeah board that we had last year. Oh, well, I missed the uh, darkly forged. Uh, Big board. Yeah, unfortunately, I pissed him off with all my bark gun jokes, and he didn't make it for us again this year. Oh so yeah, yeah, he didn't. Too bad. He well, you know what? Oh, he... here we go. We got our musical guest nominee is, from Kyle is Ozzy Osbourne. <laughs> no. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, and now we're going to get his uh, nominee for the announced team. And I will continue to run through the undercard. I just gave you that first match. Uh, we also are going to have uh, Biggie Langston versus Drew McIntyre versus Elias in a Wii Symphony of Destruction match. Uh, Akira Tozawa versus Pete Dune in an Elephant Graveyard match. Uh, Tyler Bate versus Trent Seven versus Drew Gulak versus Timothy Thatcher in a Money in the Bank match. We're going to have Walter versus Keith Lee versus Samoa Joe in a Last Man Standing match. Uh, we also uh, have AJ Styles versus Adam Cole versus Finn Balor. We have Piper Niven and Tony Storm versus the Iconics. And uh, still down here, uh, our match that was created by Xander, uh, Dude Love and Mankind and Cactus Jack versus Michael Cole and Byron Saxton and JBL. And Kyle Turner has uh, nominated for the announced team. I love this name. Joey Styles. Everyone is doing my Love that one, Kyle. <laughs> And uh, Kyle, you're rolling right along. So give us an entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble, and then we will proceed directly to uh, whatever your uh, move or change is going to be to uh, one of these undercard matches. Um, I'll also recap the super card for people who aren't seeing this. Mike Quackenbush. All right. <laughs> Quackenbush. <laughs> for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. I think he was in last year. Dang I don't it. know who put him now in last year. but someone's doing mine. Boom. <laughs> Okay, that's fine. Thank you, Kyle. I appreciate it. And and and, and Ponder put uh, a, a picture of his host nominees in the Wrestling Mayhem Show group and said, "Who wouldn't want to have these two as your co-hosts?" Yeah, absolutely. A lot of boob. A lot of boob. Uh, so, a lot of boob. It's really, like, it's really like, uh, um, it's really right, like four co-hosts. They are unsettling. Yeah. That that. Oof. That is that's an image that's gonna haunt me. Moving on, Kyle. I hope I don't I hope I don't catch you too late here because you're in tier three now. So in addition to having the option on the table, you can also swap a stipulation from one match to another, Kyle. So that can also be uh, your standard move here. Also, so see what you can come up with here. Uh, so far, right now, on this, I want to take out the six man tag. Which one's the six man tag? Um. Which six man tag? I, the one with Dude Love or the one with everybody else? 
<laughs> the one you love, or the one with Daniel Bryan. We'll get back to us in a second. Uh, the super card right now is uh, Mia Yim and Kaylee Ray and Tegan Knox versus Asuka and Kyrie Sane and Io Shirai. Uh, we also uh, have Devon. Uh, I'm sorry, Reverend Devon and Deacon Batista versus Paul London and the Brian Kendrick. Uh, we have Bianca Belair versus Jazz, and we have Edge versus Matt Riddle. Uh, none of those matches have a stipulation yet, even though that is uh, an option uh, for anyone uh, at this well, point Dave, going forward. Dave, Dave. Kyle. So we'll see if Kyle attaches a uh, stipulation to the uh, thing here. Uh, let's run through the uh, Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble uh, events here. The Dave Bryan one is the one that uh, Kyle Turner is getting rid of. So mm. given the choice of two six-mans, he decided Why? this was the one that had to go. So, we hear that. Um, so we'll see what he's going to replace this with. Quite the operation. Um, so far in the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble, fellas, Shawn Michaels, Riddick Moss, Killer Cross, The Big Show, Hooventude Guerrera, <laughs> Asuka, Bushwhacker Luke, Sami Zayn, Walter, Mike Quackenbush. I love it. I love it too. I love it. But um, I will let you know also that uh, as we're heading down the, we only have four people after Kyle. We're, we're heading, we're rolling right along here, Sorgi. Uh, Doc Remedy is scheduled to go next, but of course he's going to have a proxy. So Sorg's going to announce his moves. And then it's going to be Marcus speaking for Farnsworth. And then it's going to be Alex. And then it's going to be Mad Mike uh, going to the end. He's got to take that match that no one is the uh, Tommaso Champa. Oh boy. Versus. Killer Cross. Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay. Do we know Cross's new name, or is he still Killer Cross? Uh, they have not announced what his name okay. is going to be yet. All right. Although, they're doing the TikTok that thing in be, the promo, uh, so it might yeah, be Yeah, is that, is that who the teasers are for? I would assume so. I, oh. It, it'd be uh, funny. Thanks to the magic of... Uh... Hmm? Did we lose you, Matt? Uh-oh. Sorry, no, no, no. I was just pausing at Mike. Like, I was just going to point out that thanks to the magic of stipulations that cannot be eradicated, that uh, Champa cross match, knockout or submission only. Uh, so let's see if... Uh, that works. <laughs> Kyle that Turner works. wants to tag a... Uh, sure thing. You know, it, it, it's very appropriate. Uh, so, Kyle, we're going to wait for you to uh, give us a stipulation for uh, these matches here, and then we'll We'll be able to send Kyle on his way, and then we'll go zipping right along to the next. If they uh, do call here. Killer Cross in NXT, there will be two people in WWE with the surname Killer. Yes, that's rather impressive. Oh, they're the um, and Cross Killer Kelly in NXT UK and yes. Nikki Cross. Yes. Oh, oh, it's like it's like their their love child. Killer Kelly and Nikki Cross got together and formed Killer Cross. Uh, hmm. All right, we've got our stipulation. <laughs> You're welcome, Sork. And this is going to be for the uh, the women's tag that we've been kicking around. Okay. Uh, with the uh, Piper Niven and Tony Storm versus the Iconics, and the stipulation will be a Jim Cornette on a forklift match. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh boy. Oh, oh man. I mean, I just oh, it's is... good to have Jim in the match. So, is uh, is G Raver driving the forklift? Well, no one has spoken for G Raver yet, so no. we'll see what happens next. No. All right, Kyle, good job. We are going to move on now and find out what uh, we're going to do with uh, Doc Remedy, Sorgatron, speaking for Doc Remedy. And uh, Sorgi, uh, the doctor must nominate a, uh, a host for Mayhem Mania. Uh, Doc Remedy would, I let's see. Oh, no, that's the wrong screen. Hold on a second. We're bringing that up. He wants a host. Who would Doc Remedy pick as a host for WrestleMania? I think Chad he would. I was well, yeah, Chad, yeah, Chad the Shad. Well, I was gonna say on behalf of Chad the Shad, he would probably uh, nominate Edge, but let's just nominate Chad the Shad. <laughs> no, he nominated. Too exhausted David. to fight. He nominated don't David, tell David Mason. Ortiz. Whatever you do, don't tell Mason. Yeah. Oh my God! Where's my son? I'll go over the way, but I can't go get it. All right, nominate. All right, Doctor Remedy must nominate a musical guest for Mayhem Mania. Doc Remedy, Alter Bridge. <laughs> Bridge. 
All right. Oh, yeah, he's, we're not just... gonna, he's not going to nominate Vanilla Ice to do the ninja rap. Don't, 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 hey, don't put ideas in his head. That's right, Dr. Remedy no. must nominate a member. <laughs> must nominate what? Um, <laughs> uh, Dr. Remedy must nominate a member of the Mayhem Mania announce team. Uh, well, who we got so far? Joey Sni- Styles. Uh, that is it. We are only at Joey Styles right only now. Only Joey Styles? And, and this is a nomination. Like, this gets voted on later. Yes. Uh, Matt Stryker. Oh, boy. <laughs> All right. He's not doing anything that I'm aware of. So. Oh, boy. Um, actually, he just got announced to announce for CZW on Fight TV. Wow. Ah, they could get him. Uh, Can't be a binding contract. Uh, we, we, will we allow it? I'll allow it. Okay. Let's move. Okay. Let me see. Let me make sure. I don't want to forget anything here. I want to make sure Dr. Remedy gets something he's entitled to here. Um, all right. Uh, Dr. Remedy must, uh, name an entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. <laughs> Other push factor. No, no. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Oh, the geez. immobile bushwhacker. The immobile bushwhacker. Yes. Um, do, do, do. Let's He's gonna see. win because he can't throw. Him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't throw him out. I mean, it's like it's like the Iron Sheik roll. Um, boy. Or the, or the Zach Gowan roll. Or the Zach Gowan roll. Hey, Zach Gowan, throw him in there. <laughs> All right, we, we finally found him. Yeah, we're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. We find out. Ah, finding. Right, now find, we are going to you, let. By the way, let's take that out for a note because we haven't done an ad in the, in the first hour here. <clears throat> you you too can find Zach Gowan as a uh, part of your free trial to indie wrestling dot network, uh, where you that documentary is a part of that service. So please go check it out, and you too can find Zach Gowan. There, I'm done. Go ahead. <laughs> Good. Um. All right. All right. Um. Doctor Remedy must now uh make a change to the uh undercard. Uh, the subtract and swap a stipulation move options are on the table for him. Mm, what are we looking at here? Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. So Drew, something, add something, something. I don't really, really want to mess with too much. Jim Cornette on a forklift. <coughs> mm-hmm. um, and they're just the matches themselves, right? Is that Styles, yeah. Colin, Balor? <laughs> Mm-hmm. Let's just add uh, Gargano to that. Ooh. Okay. Okay. And now uh, Dr. Remedy can uh, add a stipulation to any match on the undercard or the supercard. Or the supercard? <laughs> or the supercard. Add a step to a match on the undercard or the supercard. That's riddle. Let's see. What is that? Mia? Let's uh do 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 do. Let's make Edge and Riddle a cage match. Wow. Okay. Steel cage. Bro. <laughs> bro, not in a cage, bro. Yeah. I like it. I like All right. It. How will he be Thank able you. to pick Thank his you, Dr. Remedy. The cage wall though? Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness. You know what? That's not our problem. They will yeah. make it work. That's right. Yeah, don't worry about it. Just like that three-way last man standing match. <laughs> All right. Uh, we move on from Dr. Remedy. We now bring in Marcus Mann, who is here as uh, Farnsworth, or as proxy for Farnsworth Investments, LLC. That's right. And, yes. Uh, Marcus, I, how are you doing? I, I'm doing well. I asked Farnsworth uh, if there was anything specifically he wanted to do to ruin the show, and he said that he trusted me to ruin it all by myself. Oh, good. That that's a lot of trust. That's a lot of responsibility. Yeah. Uh, let's get started. Let's nominate a host for Mayhem Mania. Um, this is uh, who I usually go to host anything um, at all, uh, award shows, uh, dunk contests. I don't care. Uh, I'm going to go with the Muppets. Yes. <laughs> okay. Former <laughs> Raw host. Yeah, the Muppets. Former Raw guest stars. All right, uh, nominate a musical guest. 
for Mayhem Mania. So I built Torn on Musical Guest. Um, so I want to know if this will be allowed because this this is this one's tough. Um, so I want to see Marcus. if this is an allowed move for Musical Guest. Uh, All right, I would like on. to nominate Fozzy. I knew he's going there. <laughs> is that an allowed um, move? Wow, that is that is a tough one. I don't Fuzzy, know. I, I'm trying to find uh, the loopholes in the lore here. Gig. Fuzzy, Fuzzy Bear by Moon Goose McQueen. Is that Fuzzy Bear's already in the Muppets? He's already hosting. Oh my God! Can we just have the band Fuzzy fronted by Fuzzy Bear? <laughs> ah! You know what? I'm not here to fight it, Marcus. I'll let it go. Let's roll. Well, I'm fighting, I'm uh, fighting, let's I just nominate a loophole in the lore. I think. Yeah, I think you did. Judas in my mind. Since it's a musical booking, that it's separate from a wrestling, and I think you can get away with that. All right, so I'm gonna let that one slide. Uh, let's nominate a member of the announce team. Um, I th- this one. Uh, tell me if this one's allowed to. Uh, I'm trying to find things that are not allowed. Uh, but I think he's great. Um, and <laughs> if there's anything that WrestleMania needs for an announcer, is is someone who will take a loud uh-huh. fart. So I'd like to go with Vampiro. <laughs> I mean, it seems okay for me. That was if you if Matt wasn't if Matt Stryker wasn't allowed. That's who I was going to drop was Vampiro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I just like I mean I mean reassembling the Lucha Underground announce team though. Oh, Lucha like, Underground for a lot. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, absolutely. Um, all right, name oh, and entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Okay. Also, going to see if this is allowed. Uh, <laughs> he has competed. <laughs> On a pay per view for for WWE, <laughs> oh boy! Right. And I think I it goes. would be the winner because it's impossible to eliminate him. I'm going to go with God. Oh boy! All right, I'll do. I don't know. He no showed a show in uh, Central on. PA, so. <laughs> well, I don't think you can eliminate God. That that would be how I would book that. That's supposed I mean, to be here. Where is uh, he? Point of order. If he's omnipresent, isn't he always outside the ring, too? You know what? That is for the referees to sort yeah, out, Mike. Yeah. Okay, fair. Um, fair. I, I so, figured I'd ask. I mean, it, it's a fair question. So, Orgatron, maybe in the next set of uh, referees with Brigatonis, we can uh, you can drop that on them. <laughs> and uh, yeah. have a collective uh, existential uh, uh, brain cramp over uh, whether or not God could be an eliminated. Um. <laughs> oh, All God. right, Marcus, you're doing so well. <laughs> let me um, let me lay this out for you here. What, what's next? What's next? Um, big money, big money, Farnsworth um, has gotten you into the tier four oh, of the. Uh, a Patreon powerhouse. Mm-hmm. Um, so, before you make your move to the undercard here, I must <laughs> inform you: you are granted, in addition to the you know the usual fun you know extra move options like swap mm-hmm. a stipulation or subtract, uh, you are granted essentially a reality stone. You could break the rules of our universe and literally use anyone you want <laughs> for one of these for your move on the undercard. I think he's going to do it. Oh, my God. I think he is going to do it. I can use anyone. Anyone. Anyone? Living or dead. Anyone. Oh, wow. Fozzie Bear. <laughs> uh, boy, I forget who's on the undercard. Can, we, can, you, can you pull up the undercard on the on I'd the be happy to. Here, let me run through them real quick. Here. So Super right now we have... Uh, Rover. Tommaso Ciampa versus Killer Cross in a knockout or submission match only. <laughs> uh, we have Biggie Langston versus Drew McIntyre versus Elias in a Wii Symphony of Destruction. Uh, Akira Tazawa versus Pete Dune in an Elephant Graveyard match. Uh, Tyler Bate versus Trent Seven versus Drew Gulak versus Timothy Thatcher in a Money in the Bank match. Walter versus Keith Lee versus Samoa Joe in a Last Man Standing match. We have AJ Styles versus Adam Cole versus Valor versus Johnny Gargano. We have Piper Niven and Tony Storm versus the Iconics and a Jim Cornette on a forklift match. And finally, we have Good Love and Mankind and Cactus Jack versus Michael Cole and Byron Saxon and JBL. Oof. 
Um, <laughs> all right, I'm looking here. Yeah. I already I have like Jim Cornette's your... stupid voice in my brain. Yell, get me down here. Watch you guys put me up here. Just over and over and over again in my head. On that. I'm that fucking Judy <laughs> Sound girl. Why the hell are they making me watch these girls wrestling? Oh. I don't understand all the hell you guys have wrestling now. You guys got men wrestling women. That ain't right. Can I, can I add fictional around. characters? <laughs> Added Fozzie. What? Sure. Anyone. Oh, boy. Spider Ham's going to be a mayhem mania. All right. Oh, so God, here's what I'm thinking. Can I add to that uh, triple threat last man standing match? Mm hmm. Um. And uh, I'd like to add a fourth person because why not make it even more complicated? Um, and I'd like you're to going add... against everything you've sworn to fight against. All right. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. No. This is this is uh, this is not me. This is Farnsworth. I want to make this clear. Oh, okay. Yeah. Good point. Good point. Yeah. Yeah. It's not your fault. I am here. I am here to ruin this with as many dumb moves as possible, a la Farnsworth Investments. Uh, that's our motto at Farnsworth Investments. We'll make the dumbest move possible. Uh, so I'm sorry, like the, the official add... tagline is we make the dumb possible. <laughs> uh, I would like to add uh, the biblical figure Goliath to that match. Excellent. There you go. What? Yes, that's exactly... Chris, you have used your reality stone wisely. Good job. Oh, boy. All right. Now. Oh, boy. Thank you. Marcus, I know this is going to be a foregone conclusion. Again, someone stole my fucking You must, <laughs> you must now. You, might, you now have the ability, if you choose to do so, you may fast track, auto graduate any match from the undercard directly to the supercard. Do not pass go. Do not kill my $50. Mm. Oh, man. Oof. It's the thing is, I don't. I think. I think all of those matches still need some tweaking down there. I don't think anything's perfect. Yeah. Yet. yeah. Well, I mean, you don't have to do it. I mean. Yeah, I, I think. I think you, I'm gonna, you could say these are not worthy. Can I save that? Can I save that, or do I have to do it on my turn? I'll let. I'll let you pocket that. You know, I, I'm. I'm okay. feeling real flexible right now is there only if one? someone makes a tweak that i really really like i'd like to be able to fast track something is there one person left well, well we're ways. running out of tweakers we're down to alex and mike but let's see how things go yeah here. but i think there's uh, still anyway, tweaks thank... to be done down here yeah okay well i, I thank, thank you for your hard work good job alex okay. hello hello hi alex hi sorry i had to adjust things here at the control room at the OPW uh, performance center. So I'm Excellent. here now. I have a quick question uh, be before. Okay. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Can you remind me what's been moved to the super card since we started, if any? What I have is I have my Mia Yim, Kaylee Ray, and Tegan Knox versus Asuka and Kairi Zayn and Io Shirai. Mm -hmm. The steel cage match between Edge and Matt Riddle, mm -hmm. Bianca Belair, Belair versus Jazz, and Reverend Devon and Deacon Batista versus Paul Lundgren and Brian Kendrick. That's what I have on the super card. That's right. That's it. Can I? Uh, that's, that's all that's been on the super card so far. Yes, but before you go any further, I have to. I have to clarify a point of okay. order here. Sorry. I have. Uh, okay. I have deprived Cal. What? What? Hang on, hang on. Yeah. Because I, if, if nothing else, Sorg, we have rules here. Yes, we do. We must be adhered to. A lot of them. Um, yeah, we have a lot of rules. Um, I, I I neglected to offer Kyle Turner the, the opportunity to auto-graduate a match to the Supercard. I have to give Kyle Turner the opportunity to do that right now if he wants to move something. Uh, can I make a point of order after this? Sure. Okay, just put me on. Just put me on. We suddenly on turned pause. into a county council meeting. So yeah. Well, I just I, I don't want to be forgotten about. I'll just put me on pause here. Marcus, I could never forget about you. Oh. I thought I'd get a laugh for that. Okay. <laughs> Let's see if we can. I was on mute. I was on Kyle, mute. are you out there? Okay. Yeah, he's out. He's laugh. Waiting. I'm following the rules here and being on mute. 
I hear you. Hello? Uh, while we're waiting, Xander, let's check in with Xander Gabriel, uh, who's been thrown in, thrust into this. Xander, how you doing over there? Completely up to speed. What do you need? <laughs> so <laughs> you know all the rules at this point, right? Yeah, I got the whole card memorized. Oh, Two nights, right? Is it too big for one? So, uh, yeah, I think we're almost to that point. So, it's definitely too big for one podcast. There you go. Uh, we do have an auto graduate here, uh, Matt. Do you have that for announcement? I do. Uh, Turner has auto graduated Champa versus Killer Cross, which I believe is the one he created himself. Right? <laughs> hey, that's how you do it. There you go. That's how you do it. Um. um Matt, so, Matt. uh. Kyle, Kyle, yeah, yeah, yeah. He also, gets, he also gets to make a match, right? For yes, Grant? he has to make a match, and he gets to send someone to space jail. So, there you go. And he gets to uh, name an entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble, but we will not sit here and wait. We'll let Kyle do his business first. We'll see if he gets his match out here real quick, and then we'll turn loose Alex. Uh, Alex, I have a feeling we can get this done here, uh, two at a time here. While we wait for, Al I had, a, I had a point of order. I had a point of order. Place. Oh, okay. Go ahead, Marcus. Would you? I had a point of order. Uh, <laughs> excuse me, sir. <laughs> point of order. Uh, it, it's just a question. Um, do, it, does this does this have a location? Yeah, I haven't really thought about that. So can I can I nominate I'd a like location it to be somewhere since I'm for fans. representing Farnsworth and Industries? Go ahead. Uh, since this is Mayhem Show seven oh seven, I looked up the seven oh seven area code, <laughs> uh, which is in California, and uh -oh. uh, in the seven oh seven is the is the town of uh, Bayside, California. So I think this should be at Bayside. Yes. Wait, isn't that where Saved by the Bell? Yeah, Saved by the Bell. Yes, Bayside High. Yes, okay. Bayside High School. Yeah. Bayside High. Excellent. I can. I, I, I'm down with that. Go Mr. Tigers. Belding I, still, is still I not invited. I now know who my nominee for host is. Mr. Belding's not <laughs> invited. <laughs> I now know. He's banned from all wrestling events. I know I think who my nominee year, The show number should dictate the area code that you go to and you find the town. <laughs> I like that. I like that idea. I'm here oh, to make things it. better, guys. Get That's ready good. for uh, I, Saudi mania I mean, when it comes up. Uh, oh, believe me. You, uh, more on that in a minute. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, while we wait for Kyle, our <laughs> I hate, I hate, I hate to be the bearer uh, of Kyle, that something news. got clipped off. Send that again. Wait. Oh no. What's going on? I have to be the bearer. No, no, of no. Bad no. News. I was going to say while we wait for while we wait for Kyle's match to replace the one they created, I want Alex to nominate his host for Mayhem Mania. To keep us rolling here. Okay. Um. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Hang on. Like I said, I pulled up my notes. Okay, here we go. So my nomination for host. I think last year I had nominated Drew Carey. Well, I thought about sending it to Drew Carey, but I thought it'd be more. I thought it would be better to send it to the Carey who actually has any relevance this year. So I'm sending my invite to Jim Carrey to host Mayhem Mania under one very specific circumstance. <laughs> oh, it is Jim Carrey as Dr. Robotnik. Yes. Oh, jeez. Yes. <laughs> yes. I approve. <laughs> That's great. Wait, wait, wait. Beginning of movie, Excellent. Dr. Robotnik, or end of movie, Dr. No, Robotnik? End of movie. Come on, Sorg. Just... The movie that came out. <laughs> no, no, no. That they no, no him no. from the beginning of the movie or him from the end of the movie. It's two very different versions of him as Hey, Dr. spoiler um, alert! I'm not saying I what's seen different. The movie. I seen it, yet. it was in the trailer. Maybe he <laughs> shaved his mustache. Oh, okay. okay, then whichever one is more robotic egg like... End of movie. Got end it. of movie. There you gotcha. go. End of movie. It's all right. Merry it's on Christmas. digital because nobody goes to the theater anymore, Marcus. Just get up to speed. Oh, that yeah. I should see if they released it now. It's on there. I need to, I need to check Voodoo and see if they have it already. Anyways, Alex. Uh, so yeah, before that's you host. check Hulu for Sonic the Tug, um, can you nominate a musical guest for Mayhem Mania? <laughs> musical guest. Okay. Yeah, look yeah. At this. I have I have a I have a long shot 
nomination and a more realistic one. I'm going to give you my long shot. I just need to know if this is okay. <laughs> Have you been watching? He really take, needs... take a shot every time someone asks Matt if something is okay. Okay. Because he really needs the gig this year. And by he, I mean I. I'm nominating Alex Carr's The Elixir as musical guest for Mayhem Mania. Wow. Do what now? Please, wait, wait. Please remind me what you play. Or remind the audience what you play. Uh, I do I do, I do, do a combination of electronic music and guitar music. So that's kind of the general idea of what kind of music I do. You can check it out at Alex Carr's The Elixir. The Elixir. Dot com. That's A L E X I R. Wow. wow! Not only did he get his pick in, he also got a plug in. The, the finesse is real. Great job, Alex. Yes, yes. What wow. can I say? I'm dripping. Well finesse. done. Um, so yeah, so that's my. Right, okay, Alex, so that's good, uh, and that's good. Okay. Uh, Thank goodness. Nominate a member of the announced team. Okay. Again, long shot and a more reasonable one. Long <laughs> shot pick. Is Mike Tanay? I don't think he's actually signed anywhere. I don't think he's working. Me no, neither. No, I don't think he's busy. Nope. I'll take it. So that's my nomination, Mike Tanay. All right. right. Name an entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Yeah. Okay. Since Kyle already took care of getting Mike Clackenbush in there, thank you again, Kyle. Appreciate it. You're the homie, homie. Uh, I'm going <laughs> to go down my list of Jakara people. And I'm going to no- nominate the next meaningful name. I'm going to go with Ophidian. Okay. Ophidian. Ophidian. Friend of the show. Okay. All right. He's, um, he just sneaked his way in there. Congratulations, Wrestling Mayhem Show. You've done podcasts longer than Mike Sinai. A second year of podcasts out of CBS Radio. <laughs> Thanks, guy. <laughs> Wow. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh-huh. You um, tell Mike today to suck it, Dork. For Kyle Turner. Where is Kyle? So Kyle had I, I saw a half match from him because I saw a versus R Truth in the Street Coffers. Yeah. Like I, I don't know what the first half of the intrigued. match is. Can, can we is it is it just God versus R Truth in the Street Profits? Is that what can we're we, doing? Can we fill it in? Yeah, is it a fill in the blank? Is it and now he's asking, did you get my match? Uh, no, we didn't. That's what we're trying to ask you. No, no, I, I have your match there, uh, Kyle. Kyle. Yeah. Type in the first part. Kyle. Yeah. My God. I, we, we, I forgot how long these Man. go. That's what she said. The, the online uh, opponent of uh, every. Everyone being online is uh, definitely slowing I mean, us down a little bit. I mean, year. literally, like, hey, like we're Facebook, fun, aren't we? all Facebook video is down right now, to my awareness. Wow. You broke so Facebook, do you think Bobby. this is good to play? Any... Okay, we have we have word from Kyle. I'm just going to drop it in here before I do my next move. If that's okay, because I got it right up here on the uh. screen. <laughs> Kyle, Kyle's move that uh, he's. So after graduating Tampa versus Cross, his move is going to be Breezango and Bobby Fish, aka Fish and Chip, <laughs> taking on Our Truth and the Street Prophet. Fish and Chip. Also, Thor. I am really sorry you. that Bobby Fish got on the card. Son of a bitch! <laughs> but know that it wasn't my fault. Don't shoot the messenger. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, hey, uh, excuse me. Excuse me. Point of order. Point of order. Jeez. Point of order. Uh, can I auto graduate that match? No. <laughs> yes, you may. Slide that guy right over there. All right, news. Kyle, Fish and oh, chip. You graduated a match. God. And you oh my get god. Reward. Worst week ever. Another <laughs> <laughs> match. <laughs> Kyle, you know Bobby Fish is gonna watch match. this. Whoa. Hey, Dude. hey, Matt. Hey, Matt. You want you don't want to know what I yelled at Bobby Fish sure. when I was live in the arena at Full Sail University on the last ever NXT? There, you're never getting in Mayhem Mania. How do you feel about being in a tag team <laughs> called Fish and Chips? <laughs> oh my God, Fish and Chips. That I go on record. That's the greatest tag team name I've ever heard. 
Go. I'm walking away. Okay. I, I, I got. And I just want to make, just make sure we're clear. You guys broke. You guys broke. So Kyle, good job. Oh, if you are, you have to create yet another match. Okay, wow. Kyle, please oh. dig deep. I know this is. I know we're asking a lot. Yeah, Kyle <laughs> made three matches for this show, and I haven't even made <laughs> You're one. You're welcome, Mad Mike. Fish and chips. <laughs> that that is that is just uh, stellar. Yeah. That is stellar so, wordplay. I'm just that, that anger. I'm just so glad that that's a trifecta. I'm just glad that Kyle is doing more damage to this mayhem mania than I ever could. Wow. Fish and chips. All right, hey, here you go. By, by the way, uh, by the way, um, match? I love a good hand the, no, match. no, no, it's a six man tag. By the way, uh, Garza, I know you're listening. When you make that, the the chips, the I must be lowercase, but the rest must be capital. Oh, yeah. Just you know, as as a for instance, that. as if this night is not up on him already. Poor, nothing but prayer for Antonio. Hey, at least tonight. all of them have graphics. Okay, here is um, Kyle Turner's triple threat match that he is uh, dropping in here. Kyle O'Reilly versus Cassius Ono versus Kevin Owens. So there we wow. go. All right. Hey. Alex, it is time to get to work. I will remind you that against my better judgment, judgment, you are being granted the awesome reality stone. Break the rules of our universe. Use anyone you want. I will remind you, Marcus Mann went to the Bible. Okay. So. <laughs> okay. All right. So. So, okay, so I just realized all I have left now is my standard move, add a stipulation, auto graduate, and the reality stuff, correct? Yep. Yeah, you've got your move, okay. but you have your reality stone to use for your move, and then you've got your stipulation, and then you are uh, free to auto graduate. And also, I will tell uh, Kyle Turner real quick Kyle, uh, because you've had two matches graduate, uh, you get two tickets to space jail. That you have precious little time to use, but you also get to name two more entrants for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. So, those into the chat whenever you uh, feel like it. Let's see what Alex comes up with here. Okay, so I had a very specific idea on what I wanted to do with one of these matches, and I think I have to use my standard move to, to fix this correctly. Mm -hmm. Which is a shame, but that's fine. I guess the. Mm -hmm. So, okay, you know what? We're going to do that. That'll be fine. Um, I'll, I'll tell you later what my move is going to be. Yeah, mm. I'll tell you later what my move is going to be. Okay, so for my standard move, I'm actually going to take off. I'm going to subtract Johnny Gargano. Because we had a very specific purpose to that triple threat. That is a battle of former Bullet Club leader. Yes. Oh, that's, that's the right, reason that's why right. it's set up. Johnny Gargano does not fit in that. Not yet. Or does he? <laughs> so we're taking him <laughs> off. Johnny Bullet. So we're taking him off. And I'm going to use my reality stone to right a wrong from Last Mayhem Mania. I want to cast, I would like to cast everyone's memory back to last year <laughs> at the end of Jan or about mid January. Uh, better time. When I. When I asked mainstream Matt, hey, this guy's contract is coming up in a couple of weeks mm -hmm. with New Japan. Mm -hmm. Can I book him for Mayhem yeah. Mania? And you said no. No. That's right. But I can't do that now. Presumably be presumably because we couldn't because we knew where he was going and it wasn't gonna be WWE. That's fine. Now we fast forward to tonight. Mm -hmm. Where I get to use this reality stone to to bend reality to my will, as if you will. Mm -hmm. If you will. So I'm using the reality stone to add Kenny Omega to the triple threat, making it a fatal four way battle of the Bullet Club leaders. I love it. This is the way. I love wow. it. Okay. You, you've used your powers for good, and I, and I uh, salute you for it. But and now we, I'm going to auto graduate. I'm also going to auto graduate that match to the supercard. But what? Switch. Let's do it. Let's, let's get it right. 
No, he, well, he's like a real bully. Bobby, so. this is about past. This is about past leaders. That's the clarification. I once saw um, him play horse at, at the Super Indy. <laughs> Point of border. All right. Um, <laughs> okay. So I've done everything well, I, I, except I, add. I, I must. I must pause you for a second. I must uh-huh. pause you for a second. Cal Turner chimed in. Is uh two two tickets to Space Jail. I got two tickets to Space Jail, and uh, he has sent uh, Baron Corbin and The Miz to Space Jail. Now I know oh. you're clamoring to use those two, uh, right there. But uh, two tickets to Space uh, Jail. Come on Thanks. in jail and welcome to Space Jail. Nope, never mind. Uh, did you get the Battle Rumble entries? Good. Thank you. Okay. That one's been you want to announce this real quick while I am entering, while, while I'm uh, booking oh, these that, uh, two jokes here? That was, uh, he won us in the Battle Rumble, the question mark, and Super Hentai. Excellent choices. Yes. All right. Let's see. So I guess, yeah, I guess all that's left to do is uh, add a stipulation to a match. And you must create a match and to I... fill this hole that you created on the... Uh... Undercard here. My oh friend. yeah, oh yeah. I do know. Um, I'm gonna. There are consequences do... here, Alex. You're right. You're right. I'm gonna do Bobby <laughs> F. J. Town a big solid because I don't think it was fair that the match that he worked so well on got dumped. So I'm gonna put back. Actually, I need to... Okay. Yeah. We're. I think we're good. I think we're good. We're gonna put back the trip, uh, the six man tag of Nakamura, Shinsuke Nakamura, Kushida, and Daniel Bryan. He's on, on right? Okay. Garza versus Garza. Versus Garza. Was it on Friday? Friday. Friday. And and or and, and a a a a a and all right, well, there we go. This is the wow. way. Wow. Jeez. I don't want you uh, to, to step out of here without getting all your prizes, Alex. Uh, you can um stipulation to one of these matches. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay. Um, this is like Christmas. I just want to take a well, moment. Right. And appreciate the fact once more that WLC got that WLC escaped from space jail. And I want to mm-hmm. thank Kyle Turner for giving me a match to make a WLC match. Mm-hmm. We're going to make Fish and Chips versus Our Truth and the Street Profits a WLC match. Oh my gosh. Oh, don't make me hate mm-hmm. WLC. This is the way. I no, I just I just had a I just had a really great picture in my head of R Truth getting terrified climbing up a third step on a ladder. <laughs> that that happened with like a, a step ladder, remember? Yeah, I'm you sure. A step I, ladder yeah. out. God, okay, hold on. I gotta go find it. I remember this now. <sighs> Alex, because yeah. you graduated a match, you do get to send one person to space jail. And you do get an extra entrant into the main cluster battle rumble. Take your time, Mad Mike. Yeah, <laughs> mm-hmm. you've waited long enough. Oh, point of order. Um, point of order. Yes. Uh, uh, before Mike goes, Mike, uh, I do have a space jail removal still in my back pocket. So, um, much like Whammy, uh, can I pass that spin over to you so that you would have two people to take out if you would like to? No. No, I will not allow that to happen. No. Really? Well, then, no. can I just take someone out if Mike wants me to? I mean, I can't stop you from doing that. All right. I'm just letting you know that's out there if you need it. Okay. <laughs> duly noted. Um, <laughs> all right. Okay, Mad Mike. Nominate a host for Mayhem Mania. You know, Matt, I have a lot of power in my hands right now. Yeah. Um, uh-huh. a, a lot Lute- of... I'm I'm gonna be perfectly honest. A Lieutenant lot of moves Mike. I was going to make have already been made. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Lieutenant Mike, you I got new hands. 
Um, <laughs> so for the potential host of Mayhem Mania, I think there's no one better than our illustrious Sorgatron. Mm. Sorg, I think there's no one better. Sorg, I nominate you as host of Mayhem Mania. Okay. Yeah. All right, Mad Mike. Yeah. I'm sorry. Hey, I was going to nominate Harry Aguado, but I'm like, you know what? Sorg has put up with a lot tonight. Yeah, I... <laughs> hey, we're fine. Uh, uh, Mad Mike, nominate a you. Yes. 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 Oh, like, oh, yes. Um. Um. I. So um, I, I'm. I'm gonna go ahead and play that card of adding of putting someone to space jail right now. Uh huh. I can't think of anyone that else that really deserves to be put into space jail. I'm putting in Mr. McMahon just to be safe. Wow. Okay. <laughs> All right. Fine. There goes my move. <laughs> Joking. Um. Okay. Uh, musical guest again. I was really uh, begging for that eleventh hour for uh <laughs> for, for the way to host like a moment. Yeah. All right, <laughs> musical guest. <laughs> by the way, way Miss Vince McMahon would be a great musical guest. Yeah. yeah, he's right. Okay, so uh, musical guest again. I was going to nominate Poppy because Poppy, but uh, Tina took care of that for me so thank you tina so i uh would like to nominate as musical guest of mayhem mania the band crap <laughs> sork never this heard of that uh, sure this is what happens when <laughs> every plan i have goes out the window <laughs> are you wearing the Mike, crap would you uh, crap band shirt, sork? are you oh my god please <laughs> Sorg, if you're if you're wearing, yes, <laughs> written in the stars a million miles away, <laughs> we're on our way. On audio, uh, the shirt I'm wearing underneath my Stone Cold shirt I was wearing to, to the show today says "Hip Hop Crap Star," and it was one of our shirts from the, when we were. Rappers. I I love it. Twelve I love years it. ago, that was not. Dude, that's great. Hey, Matt. Yeah, Matt, sorry to sorry to interrupt, but I'm also gonna go ahead and make my play for the Battle Rumble entrant. Uh, it just yeah. occurred to me since uh, since the match that I had high hopes for having on the card got dumped early on, or a little while ago, I'm gonna go ahead and put the other half of that mm -hmm. match. Uh, since Sam, Sammy Zayn's already in there, I'm gonna put Legero in there, just that way he's booked. All the right, card. respect for Legero. Okay. Who knew? <clears throat> uh, where are we here? Um, I can nominate a member of the announce team. Um, well, let's see. I, I was going to say Joey Styles, but already been taken care of. So, <laughs> and no, I'm not going to nominate Sork. Um, I'm going to say Triple H. Ooh. Because just because he's in space he's jail in doesn't mean he can't be on the announce team. <sighs> All right. He was great on SmackDown. Mm -hmm. Imagine, if you will, an announced team of Triple H and Vampiro. I respect <laughs> anyone that finds loopholes in this game. Anyone. <laughs> I appreciate that. Bad Mike, give me a uh, give me an entrant for the Mayhem Cluster Battle Rumble. Oh, Ziggy Haim. <laughs> If I if I see if I see if I see people like Walter and Shawn Michaels in there, I want Ziggy Haim to punch him in the face. You know what? If I, I, and you know, she wants to be in there. So yep. yes, yes. I guarantee she would love to be in that match. If I had a tag team to pick, it'd be Ziggy Haim and uh uh Jinx. No, if I had if I had to do a tag team, it'd be, it'd be Ziggy Haim and Shotzi Blackheart. Ooh, ooh, there you go. There you yep. go. But anyways, back to the real mayhem. And I will call them tank girls. Anyway. Uh, okay. All right, Mike. Um, yes. You know the deal. Reality Stone. Uh, make mm -hmm. your move. Uh, remember, the uh, you have uh, the subtract option and the swap stipulation, but uh, you also have a Reality Stone. So uh, do your thing. Uh, now, all right. Uh, point of order. I'm, point of order. And Marcus can confirm me, but I do believe it's Ziggy Heim. 
Ziggy Hyman, excuse me. Yes. Excuse me. I'm sorry. Yes. It is, it is Hyman. I've, yes. I've had a lot of vodka. It, it, I apologize. There you go. I've had I've had some Tito's. I had a whole brisk full of Tito's lemonade and iced tea. I just wanted so, to re- I just wanted to reason the same point of order to be completely honest. That's fine. Yeah. Um. All right. Now, in 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 this troubled time, I was going to use my normal move to strictly to screw over Alex Cars by moving the WLC stipulation. To a match that I know will never make it onto the card. Huh. But in these troubled times, I'm going to allow, I'm going to be the bigger man here. I'm going to allow Alex to have his WLC match. And I'm going to use the track option. Okay, man, Mike. And and Matt Matt um the match between Samoa Joe Walter and Keith Lee is still just a triple threat right? No, also Goliath. Uh no, uh Marcus Mann added Goliath from the bottle. Oh boy, I forgot about that. God damn it! Can't do that. Again. <laughs> you tried, Mike. You tried. One thing I want to. <laughs> yeah, and also, also I added last la- last uh, man no, I was standing. No, I was okay back. with that. That was like an hour and a half ago. Yeah. It was like an hour and a half ago. I believe. Wait, so is it, wait, okay with that. Was it Last Man Standing or Last Man Standing Alive? I, I'm I'm confused. Ooh. Last Man Standing. So okay, if someone so so if someone more. takes a nap, if if someone okay. slings Goliath in the eye and he's down for ten, that he's he's gone. Just, All right, just so you know what? Since I can't make the one fucking match I wanted in this whole damn thing, I there am moving the WLC stipulation. To the faces <laughs> of Foley versus the announcers match because that's never getting on the card. Mm. So we all see is taken off of the super card. Mm. I say I came back to some excitement. Yes, that is a nasty, nasty move. All right, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, Matt, I was Mike, point of order, I'm bigger man, but you know, fuck it. Point fuck of it. order. <laughs> <laughs> I'm from California. I got nothing. I just wanted to say point of order. Uh, and, and the best thing is, I can do this because I'm using the Alex Cars rule. <laughs> All right. Uh, anyway. Um, Would you like to auto-graduate a match? Perhaps um, the WLC. I, <laughs> no, I'm not auto can, can you? I'm sorry. Can you run down the undercard? Oh, uh, there's a no, link in the chat. I'd there, love to. There's a link in the hangout. I like. would love to. What was that, Sork? Uh, there's, have... a, there's a link in the hangout to the jam board if you want to see. Yeah, I tried clicking on that like at least 18 times. You oh, never access. mind then. Okay. <laughs> I've tr- I, trust me. I've uh, tried the the undercard. Uh, here's what we got on the undercard. Mm-hmm. Uh, Kyle O'Reilly, Cassius Ono versus Kevin Owens. Okay. We have Big E Langston versus Drew McIntyre versus Elias in a Wii Symphony of Destruction match. Akira Tazawa versus Pete Dune in an Elephant Graveyard match. Tyler Bate versus Trent Seven versus Drew Gulak versus Timothy Thatcher in a Money in the Bank match. Okay. Walter versus Keith versus Samoa Joe versus Goliath in a Last Man Standing match. Okay. Nakamura and Kushida and Daniel Bryan versus Angel Garza and Andrade and Jorge Fall. We have Piper Niven and Tony Storm versus the Iconics in a Jim Cornette on a forklift match. Oh and finally, we have Love and Mankind and Cactus Jack versus Michael Cole and Byron Saxton and JBL in a We LC match. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, mm-hmm. let, let's. Right. Let, oh, boy. That is, that is some card. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> um, let's graduate the Wii Symphony of Destruction match. Yes. Yes, right. because because I feel I feel the we people should be represented, but just not by we LC. Point of order. Nope. Nope. I just, no, no. Like a real right. one? I just want I just I just want to make one comment, especially since Mike's wearing those gauntlets. Perfectly balanced as all things should be. Exactly. Yeah. That's that's why we all see is not going to be on the card. Um, 
Okay, so then I Mike. get to yeah, I get to make a new match. Yeah, you gotta get, gotta make I a new match here. Space jail, and you know what? Fuck it. Let's um let's send El Torito spa- to space jail. Wait, wait, who who you, who you send into space jail? Why are you send space jail? You can't send someone to space jail because I graduated a match. You didn't graduate the match. The match graduated. Someone who created that match gets the reward. So who created the Big E Langston versus Drew McIntyre versus Elias match? <gasps> it was Sorgatron! <gasps> ah! But so you get to walk- create a match to uh, oh, fill that hole. I can't jail oh, yeah. any I can't double I can't double space jail somebody that's already on the supercard, huh? No double jeopardy. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Then there's case- no there's no power in this universe that can send Bobby Fish. Back to space uh, and the other person, I would have, I would have sent a proxy. Uh, okay, okay. You're gonna send um, someone on his behalf. You know what? I'm gonna throw somebody in there that I don't like just because. Just throw, uh, uh throw Sammy Guevara in there. <laughs> oh dear. Thank I, you, sir. I don't care if he's Thank in you. AEW. I don't care if he's in AEW. Just, just. Thank you so much. Just do it. Just to be safe. You gotta yeah. be safe. Yeah, yeah. I can't. I can't. I don't. I don't trust you guys. Even though I'm the only one back. Like, yes. Capable of anything. All of this. Even though he collects pops, I don't like him. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Okay. I was going to book Sammy uh. Guevara. <laughs> um, wow. All right, so Sorg makes a makes a match then too, right? Uh, no, you make the match. You're the one who graduated. No, wait, wait. You graduated. See, this is Sorgatron what... makes the match. Yeah, that's you're right. Sorgatron has to make the match okay. to fill the spot. Yeah, yeah. See, that's why I need like 20 people here to keep track of all this stuff. Follow yeah. the lore. <laughs> Follow the lore. Sorgi, they have rules. You get them. to make the last match. Wait, I get to make the last match? Yeah, because well, we I, have to I, fill I the saw, spot on I the undercard. Moves to go, but... Yeah, and I got a space jail removal if you need it. <laughs> a space yeah, jail so... removal? So if you want to book Triple H, Sorg, now's your chance. Or if you want to set Sasha Banks free from Space Jail. Sasha Banks is in there. Oh, actually, wait, no. You um Marcus, you said I could use one of your moves on your behalf, right? Yeah, if you wanted to, you could use mine. Let's free Sasha Sp- Sasha Banks from Space Jail. I'm freeing Sasha Banks. <laughs> Very well. Listen to Matt Banks Mike is space move <laughs> okay. Okay, then uh, let's get uh, Sasha Banks uh, versus. Uh, wait, is she in there? Is she in there? Do, 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 do. Uh, Shayna Baszler. Nope. Shayna Baszler. Shayna Baszler works. Shayna Baszler. Shayna Baszler. Sasha and Shayna. Shayna Baszler. Shayna Baszler. Damn, I was going to. Shayna Baszler. Shayna Baszler. Shayna Baszler. I was going to. I was going to add the Boston Hug connection to that women's match. Can I throw but... Tony Storm in there, too? Nope, she's in another match. Is she? Sorg, I was, I mean, was going to... This is complicated. I, I, okay. I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy You're with telling that. me. I'm happy okay. with that. Excellent. All right. Well, it's done. Good job, everybody. Mm-hmm. Uh, we did it. Uh, I'm not done. I can rest now. I'm oh, not do done. Do do I haven't no, no, no. I every... did everything. I haven't done anything. What I haven't used yes, my reality. Yes, you did. You. Stone. I have not I used my reality. Stone. You, 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 you <laughs> had the reality stone to use for your move, and you, blinded <laughs> by spite, moved the We All See match. That was your move. You didn't use your reality stone. No, that's not. Sp- so it goes. I'm looking you, at the list. Yeah, with the, stone. the list says that make for your one move. standard move. The list says make yeah. one standard move and reality stone. They are separate entries, sir. Yeah, um, that's, uh, that, that's your kind own of uh, reading between the lines, but that's uh, oh, no, that's not my fault. No, no, uh, that's that's literally, literally reading the floor line. is very clear on this. That, yeah, no, well, that's um, literally that's reading the, the line. Point of order, I agree with Matt Mike. That is that is a confusing. That's an and, not an or. In, in yeah, the that is an and. You know what? You know what? I'm curious to see what you're gonna do anyway. So, do whatever the hell you want. My <laughs> peach shine is almost gone. There ain't enough booze right, in um, the world. To make okay. this night go any faster. But soon we, I will accomplish my goal of getting us all to midnight and then we will sing happy birthday to Sora. Exactly. See, this is what I'm trying to do. Okay. Um all right, so my reality stone. Oh boy. 
Oh, oh shit, it's right. Yeah, Sorg. It's going to happen. We're going to sing to you. It's going to be great. Um, my reality stone move. I, oh. This is a match. You know, you wanted to do it so bad, I would have thought you'd yeah. have something in mind. No, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to build some gravitas here. He's okay? trying to oh, kill okay. time. Mad Mike, feel free to reclaim your time at you are, any time. You are. I'd like to point out that. Um, oh yeah, I'd like to point out that. Sorry, it took me a second to remember what. Okay, I'd like to point out that Mad Mike even said that a lot of his moves were already made for him. Yeah, that's why he's struggling now. This is this true. is what happens when you bat last. Half half my shit was already done. Um, I am going to. To that big hoss match, that if I can't have it my way, I'm going to add the the eighth wonder of the world, Andre the Giant, to oh, Goliath, I love this move. to Goliath love this move. versus Walter versus Keith Lee, That's fantastic. versus Samoa, <laughs> and and if you think. Well, it's Andre. not Andre. If you think Andre is taking that bump for any of y'all, you're fucking wrong. You're fucking wrong. And and can can we call that the does anybody want a peanut match? I mean, no baby you can oil. Add a stip if you want. <laughs> oh, I can ask stipulation. Oh boy. Um, okay, uh, the stipu- the ad stipulation for that five man last man standing match, you must only use your left hand. <laughs> okay. In honor of the Princess Bride. Okay, I got you. Yes. Okay. <sighs> wow. What a beautiful match. We're done. <laughs> We're officially done now. That's it? Yeah. Okay, what do we got? What's the official list? One last time. Here's your super card, Sorgi. Happy birthday to you, buddy. I got you a present. Here we go. Mia Yim and Kaylee Ray and Tegan Knox versus Asuka and Kyrie Sane and Io Shirai. The Reverend Devon and Deacon Batista versus Paul London and Brian Kendrick. Bianca Belair versus Jazz. Edge versus Matt Riddle in a steel cage match. Tommaso Ciampa versus Killer Cross in a knockouts or submission only. R Truth and the Street Profits versus Fish and Chips, Bobby Fish and Brizango. AJ Styles versus Adam Cole versus Finn Balor versus Kenny Omega. And Biggie Langston versus Drew McIntyre versus Elias in a Wii Symphony of Destruction match. Um, also, the eight matches on the undercard um, will let people vote on which one of these will make it to the Mayhem Mania pre show. Uh, you've got. Uh, Kyle O'Reilly versus Cassius Ono versus Kevin Owens. Walter versus Keith Lee versus Samoa Joe versus Goliath versus Andre the Giant. And a last man standing where they must only use their left hand. Sasha Banks versus Shayna Baszler. Nakamura and Kushida and Daniel Bryan versus Angel Garza and Andrade and Jorge Bali. Kira Tozawa versus Pete Dunne in an Elephant Graveyard match. Piper Niven and Tony Storm versus the Iconics in a Jim Cornette on a forklift match. Tyler Bate versus Trent Seven versus Drew Gulak versus Timothy Thatcher in a Money in the Bank match. And finally, Dude Love and Mankind and Cactus Jack is Michael Cole and Byron Saxon and JBL in a WLC match. Wow. My work yeah, is done. We've done good work here, guys. Wow. Wow. Finally, Matt Carlins can, can sleep. What a beautiful match. What? Jeez. And coming soon, Mayhem Slam for August. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, that is it. We've done it. We did it. We did it. We did it again. Uh, and since the poor guy had to sit here here for the last two hours, Xander Gabriel. <laughs> say, Am I done? Can I go? You can, if you want to go, I was going to say if you have anything, you have a topic you want to discuss for the show. I was going to throw that out to you here. Uh, so so I can have something for you to do, and we can see more of your backdrop over there. Yeah, this is my new one. I have one that says Xander Gabriel of Googly Eyes. This one says the Xander Zone. Um, I'm like a tag team champ in one company, and 
I host the Xander Zone at Prospect Pro Wrestling. Unfortunately, we just had to cancel our show on April 11th. Absolutely. Is it one of the few, like, there's not a lot of interview segments happening in wrestling. And uh, uh, and, and it's been kind of cool. on the Indies, yeah. Yeah, so, and, and, and I'm excited because I know that we've, we've seen some of the things that you've been dressing up uh, in anticipation of the next time that you get in the ring there. Uh, so, um, and, and I see that you're taking care of your, your championship belt. It was wearing a seatbelt. The belt was wearing a seatbelt, guys. Over on his Instagram. Um, I mean, that's that's just good belt maintenance. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so, so, so you can never be too careful. Um. So we the, we we had a we've we've gone two hours, guys. This is screwing up my Instagram posting. So uh, we'll just go around then, uh, guys. What did you what did you learn from Mayhem Mania? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> and will it be? And it, will it have a bigger crowd than WrestleMania this year? I learned that I'm becoming Judas in my mind. <laughs> waka waka! Somebody has to have done that, right? I learned probably. I learned what it takes for us to break Facebook Live. Yeah, seriously. Thank goodness for restreaming backups. So, uh, I learned that uh, Bayside High School is in the seven hundred seven area code. Yep. Yep. And that's going to be the host, uh, the host location for Mayhem Mania this year. Congratulations, guys! There was no other nominee, so <laughs> I, I was, I, I, you know, I forgot about that, and I was going to nominate AC Slater to be the host of Mayhem oh. Mania. And I completely forgot because he is the wrestling champion at Bayside High. Mm-hmm. But mm-hmm. Let us not forget, never forget, AC Slater, Albert Clifford. <laughs> Don't ask me why I know that. Wow. Ponder, how about you? What'd you learn? Well, I learned like uh, professional football when you think that Mayhem Mania is just about done. And after someone said, oh, there's only two people left, the show goes on for another hour. As a point of order, I might add. As a point of point order. Point of order, yes. Dean, how about you? Dean, are you muted? We might have mutes. Or the microphone has failed. Uh-oh. Something has happened. Uh oh. Oh no. Did we lose Tina? Uh oh. Put it in the chat. Yeah, put it in the chat. We'll look yeah, at you. Put it in the chat. Uh, Kyle. Hey, Carl learned that fish and chips is all it took to to break Mad Mike. Yep. Uh. <laughs> and Legit. That, that's the best damn name I've ever heard. Yeah. 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 Uh, uh, Matt, uh, Matt, what did you learn? Sorg, I learned so much. <laughs> learned. Here, here's what I learned most of all, and this is this is coming straight from the heart. Helps you, Sorgatron, my podcasting brother. Helps you just a little bit that I have to suffer through this crap tonight and for the last two months. If it helps you just a little bit, then it was all worth it. And I don't regret a minute of it. So that's all I have to say about that. Fantastic. Well, it's the craziest experiment, and it's awesome to see you guys. And and also, because I don't know how I conduct a show if I was trying to um, figure out where the stream went in the middle of the show. So it's kind of nice to sit back and let somebody else uh, in the driver's seat for a little bit. Did I miss anybody here other than Tina um, we're trying to get back I, in? Sorg, I, I learned that if you have a choice to take the high road or take the low road, Try to take the high road, but when that doesn't happen, gravity can only bring you down. <laughs> wow! Wow! Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, on that note, I think I have everybody. I'm going to get here um, because I don't want singing to happen in 20 minutes. Uh, so, uh, uh, oh, th- Sorg, uh, hold on. Mm. Sorg, you know what's funny about this thing? Hmm. Um, it doesn't only have a reality stone on it. It has a time stone. Oh, no. So I think we should sing the sword right now. No. I, I think, guys, 
Guys, show of hands, point of order, should I use the time stone to officially make it Sorg's birthday? No, 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 no. Oh, I see a lot of hands in the chat. Yay. Sorg, oh, oh, Sorg. Fucking... We're doing the thing. Do it. And, Do it. and a three, two, one. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. And with that, we broke the internet again. Oh, no. <laughs> What the hell? Because flag your video, Poor guys. Poor. This was always the plan. Go, thank you so this much. Thank you, Marcus. Man, please go check out Rise Wrestling with a Y. They're posting a lot of great videos over there. Uh, follow, follow the Breaker of Gains on social media and make up for me dropping them into the worst guest spot on a show ever. Uh, so, <laughs> well, Xander, we'll get you back on a normal show sooner or later here. Uh, sooner than later. And uh, thank you for taking the time here. Thank you, everybody. Uh, thank you, Patreon supporters, because you filled an entire show. Uh, <laughs> more Like tw- like two shows uh, at this point here. Uh, we'll be back next week. We'll be talking uh, whatever the hell wrestling looks like at that point. Uh y- yes yes boy yes we have a hand raised. Sorry. Yes, I I'm sorry I I don't I I just have one more point of order. Uh, I'd I'd like to do a quick plug. Go for it. That's okay. Occupy Pro Wrestling LLC official business. Uh, I actually have a new podcast coming up. I've already posted it on the Patreon for our Patreon supporter Gil Bradley. Uh, but I will have the show posted on the regular podcast feed tomorrow. I've also started up a new podcast called The Bright Side of Wrestling. First episode is looking at the silver lining of WWE's Elimination Chamber event. So, yeah, check it out at OccupyForWrestling.com. Thank you, Sorg. No problem. Thanks. Go check it out. Thank you, everybody that joined us. We'll see you guys next time. Mayhem out. Wait, just wait, just wait, just wait, just wait. Wait for the perfect time to get This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.